I hate everything about this. This sunshine beating down on you from morning onward. These students who don't have a thought in their heads and having to hike up this steep slope every day from today just to get to school. It all makes me want to vomit. Joining us today is Nishimi Kearakun, all the way from Yokosuka. It seems he was at the top of his class at his previous school. I hope all of you study just as hard as he. I'm Nishimi. Nice to meet you. I'm used to this routine, but... Their unreserved stares. Their Kyushu dialect that I can't follow. This is the most memorable welcome I've received yet. Nishimikun! Nishimikun! Have you decided what club you're going to join? Are you interested in radios? Look at that loser. What a nerd. Two four-eyed bookworm runts. They're made for each other. <laughs> S sorry. Because of me, they picked on you too. Infantile creeps like that can't do anything unless they're in a pack. Huh? I'm not interested in them. Nishimikun. Not interested in radios either. Uh. Nishimikun, there's one thing. I just wanted you to know. It's a bad idea to antagonize the guy who sits behind me. He's a notorious thug that even the teachers can't manage. His name is Kawabuchi, and if he zeroes in on you, it's over. Oh no. Just thinking about it makes me feel nauseous. Nishimi-san? Nishimi-san? <laughs> I'm Okai Ritsuko, the class representative. The vice principal wanted me to show you around the school during lunch break, so I'll be your guide today. I'm glad to meet you. Uh, I <laughs> don't feel sick anymore. So the gymnasium and track and field are both back there. And the infirmary is in this building right next to the science lab. Oh. 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 Are you okay, Nishimi-san? Oh, what do you think you're well, doing? Sorry, dude. It just kind of slipped out of my hands. Sorry about that. <laughs> Never saw him before. Um, Makai-san? Where's the roof? I've moved from school to school ever since first grade. If something unexpected happened, I would lose my equilibrium, and even minor stress would trigger nausea. But one time, I found a place at school where I could regain my bearings. That's right. If I can just get to the roof. What's this? After all of these years. Wait, who the hell are you? Uh, Why are you holding my hand? Uh, you're the one that grabbed my hand. I get it. You're that darn key burglar, aren't you? In that case, I ain't gonna hold back. <laughs> you, Centaro? Huh? This what you're looking for? Then you goons are the thieves, huh? The roof belongs to the smokers, the seniors. Wait. Huh? I want the key to the roof. A candy ass like you better get the hell out of here. <laughs> so then, you want the key that badly? I want it. Keep a hold of this for me.
Hey, are you all right? Hey, come on, wake up. How reckless can you be? Going up against three seniors like that. <laughs> well, this is what you wanted, isn't it? So then you'll really give it to me? Yeah, here. For a hundred thousand. Don't tell me you thought I'd give it up to you for nothing. I put my ass on the line getting it. A hundred thousand's cheap. Damn it! Well, I'm going home. <laughs> Come to think of it, I didn't even go to class once today. Huh. City kid. I can't believe you, Sentaro. You got in another fight? It's just some scratches. <laughs> huh? Uh. You! Hey! Rico, who's this guy? I'm not going to answer a guy who does nothing but fight all the time like a crook. Hm. Maruo, you tell me. He, his name is Nishima Karukun, a kid that transferred in today. Supposed to be rich and a real brainiac. Oh. Huh. Later, Maruo. Hi there, rich boy. From now on, your name is Richie. You and I are going to be best friends. Oh no. I feel sick again. Sorry. I've got a favor to ask. Huh? I can't pay 100,000. But could you lend me the key just this once? Hmm? Oh, this. But right now, it's... <laughs> hey! It's raining outside! That's no problem if I take an umbrella. Sounds like fun. I'll go too. What the hell? This ain't much fun at all. Of course not. I'm not up here to have fun. Then why bother coming up here? If you're bored, you can always go back. Nah. Class just ain't my style. This feels good. Richie, you take a shower too. Leave me alone. <laughs> what are you scared of, huh? Nothing good's ever come of fear. Let yourself get a little wet, bro. Live a little. <gasps> what in the world happened? Jeez, both of you guys? Good grief. You guys are trying to kill me. I'm taking you to the nurse and getting you a towel. Oh, shoot. That's right. I'll get your gym clothes. I'll meet you there. Don't get into any more trouble. I mean it. Is that... is that jazz? Wait a minute. You can tell? Well, sort of. I play piano. Classical music, mostly, though. Ha! <laughs> Classical, huh? What a drag. Here I am. Huh? Where's the nurse? Where'd she go? Looks like she's out. Why? I have to admit that I didn't really notice before with your glasses on, but... You have a really pretty face. It's so forward. Oh, I'm sorry. Is it rude to call a man pretty? I meant handsome. I'll admit I do have rather... Uh, have you lost 
your mind! I'm a human hairdryer is all, dude. Centauro! Ha! <laughs> there he goes again. Being scared. What a fraidy cat. I am not afraid of you. Oh, yeah? How could I be afraid anymore? After all, that rain felt wonderful. Way better than I imagined. <laughs> How very strange. Even with everyone staring at me, I can breathe normally. What kind of magic is this? That's great, Dad. Being able to play the piano, even being a sailor? Kaoru, I'm going to be away again for quite a while. Be a good boy while I'm gone, okay? When I play the piano, I find myself able to forget all of the unpleasant things and the loneliness from Dad being away. Don't worry, Karu. Your uncle in Kyushu has a huge grand piano. You'll love it there. Dad, I don't want a grand piano. What I want is... You're up really early today, huh? You want to play the piano? Go on ahead. You should play piano because Mariko feels like hearing a tune that'll wake her up. Uh, but playing this early in the morning would But I would want be... to hear it right now. You have to play it now. Mariko will take responsibility, so please, 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 right, please, fine. please, please. doing huh? playing the piano at this hour don't you have any sense i'm sorry auntie mariko chan wanted see this is why i told you to stop it putting the blame on someone else i guess it's difficult for a father to raise a child alone although it's your mother who's responsible for abandoning the both of you nishimi-san oh Mukai-san. Sentaro didn't come today, huh? Maybe you're lonely without him here, feeling out of place. Really? As if I'm aware of his comings and goings. Huh? It wouldn't matter to me if he extended his absence all semester. I see. That's weird, because to me it looked like you two were hitting it off. Everyone else is afraid of Sentaro, but you act normal in front of him. You know... I bet there's a really good chance you and Sentaro could become really good friends before too long. What is wrong with her? Always smiling at me like that. Ugh. Really? As his childhood friend, I can guarantee it. Childhood friend? Well, so that's why you're so casual with each other's names. Oh, you can call me by my name too, Nishimi-san. <laughs> and then maybe, maybe I'll just decide to call you Koura-san. What is this echoing in my head? Oh, sorry, I said that without asking. No, it's fine. If you don't like it... I don't mind it at all. Oh, that's right, Re... John? Yes? Do you happen to know of a record shop in town that sells classical music? Records? We've got tons of records at my place. You should come over. Huh? You know what I really mean by inviting you over, don't you? I... I think things are moving too fast. Is this how Kyushu girls behave? This is our shop. And this is my father. Fa... M my name is Nishima Kaoru. Your daughter has been very kind. <laughs> the classical records are over on that shelf. But... right. What kind of records are you looking for? Well, like piano music. I play the piano myself, you see. Huh? You play the piano? Uh, it's not a big deal, really. Come 
with me. Let's go. Outsiders aren't allowed in there. Dad, Coruscant is a good friend of mine and Centauro. Sen's friend? No, I'm not his friend. Oh, Just a... he won't mind. Come on, let's go. Come on in. Go ahead. What is this? What the hell are you doing here? I might ask you the same question. Rico, we got an intruder. Listen to this, Centaro. Coruscant says he can play piano. Yeah, I get it, I know, I know. But bet you anything is just rich kid stuff shirt classical stuff. Jazz is the only music for me. I don't... Rico! Only jazz is allowed in here! Uh... If it's the piano you want, I'll play it! Oh, I know this piece. I can't stand it anymore! It's like this! You could not be any farther off, dude. Well, obviously, you're tone deaf. That was note for note. There wasn't any swing. If you play it without feeling it, it don't sound like no jazz. Hey, I got an huh? idea. Huh? I'd love to hear you two do a session together. What? Nah. Huh? Nah, Rico. That's a no-go. This poor sap don't get jazz at all. Got no sense for it. Bar music. Nine minutes at the keys, and I'll be Miles Davis. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> Thank you for having me over. Um, Coruscant, come back again, okay? Richan, do you happen to know the name of the tune he was playing on the piano? Huh? Um, I... The only thing Sen can play on the piano is the intro to this. Art Blakey and the Jazz Messengers moaning. Yes, thank you, I'll take that. Wait a minute. Wasn't he here to buy classical music? Yeah. I don't know why, but his drums just wouldn't stop thundering in my head. Corazon? Uh, wh what? I'm sorry for asking, but aren't you walking kind of weird? Really? This is how I always walk. <laughs> Ow! Rico! Richie! See ya! You're running down this slope that I hate so much like it's nothing. What can you see beyond the hill? Maybe an outlook? Some way of seeing I've never seen? You could not be any farther off. Well, obviously, you're tone deaf. That was note for note. There wasn't any swing. If you play it without feeling it, it don't sound like no jazz. Richan, do you happen to know the name of the tune he was playing on the piano? Art Blakey and the Jazz Messengers, moaning.
My aunt's gone grocery shopping for dinner. I've got one hour to make it or break it. Dissonant chords, syncopation, and a unique accent. Understood the distinctive features of jazz in my head, but reproducing them was proving to be extremely difficult. This guy don't get jazz one bit, and he's got no sense for it. Damn it. No matter what it takes, I'm gonna show him up. I want to master this as soon as possible, and then perform it in front of him and Richon. You... you win! Oh my gosh! That was wonderful! As if... Well, well, Nishimi-kun! Huh? Looks like you're in a good mood. Where are you going so happy? Huh? <laughs> Don't make a fuss. That's not true! Cut it out. Let me go. What did I ever do to you? It's my neck. It kind of hurts. Huh? <laughs> These days, I got a crick in my neck that just won't quit, and it's putting me in the worst mood. So I thought having a little fun like this would brighten my day. Other than that, you've kind of been getting on my nerves recently. Huh? What's that supposed to mean? <laughs> He's on the kendo team. So you'd best not resist. <laughs> Centauro! Huh? There's trouble. Come quick. Let's see. How can we entertain ourselves? How about splitting his melon? <sighs> don't... don't hurt me. We can do better than that. What do you say we pants him? Yeah, now that's an idea. Don't... don't hurt me! <clears throat> don't move. Keep nice and quiet. Those little hotties from the girls' school come home this way, too. So this will give them something to look at. <laughs> huh? oh! Oh! <sighs> too much momentum there. Hey, you still alive? Hey, when this jerk wakes up, tell him that no real man gangs up on a weakling. What? Richie, is that you? I'm uh, oh, sorry about that. Are, are you okay? Come oh. on, get up, dude. Oh, your front tooth is... What are you just standing there looking at me for? I don't care how you dumbasses do it. I want him eating dirt. Oh, what's this? We gonna play a game like Monkey in the Middle? Oh, no. At this rate... <laughs> <laughs> Reach on? What are you? Uh, Centaur will uh, take care of them, so so get away. Huh? Huh? Look at there. <laughs> Clearly, you boys ain't used to scrap. <laughs> I look pathetic. Reach on literally caught me with my pants down, and on top of that, she rescued me. Reach on. Would you hold on to my glasses for me? Huh? <laughs> I think I'll pay you back for knocking out my front tooth. Huh? Huh? What the hell? 
Is he dead? Well, are you guys up for some more? I, I'm gonna see to it that everyone in class gives you the cold shoulder. What? You and me are in the same class? Can't remember seeing this guy. B be prepared! Uh, uh. Oh my gosh, your your forehead is bleeding. Are you okay? Don't worry about his forehead. Those fingers of yours, they doing okay? Huh. He's actually keeping an eye out for me. I'm home. So, you took another good pounding. Oh, and you got a visitor. Mm -hmm. They're downstairs. Could it be Brother June? Come on, dude! <laughs> Why is the little squirt beat up, too? He was in a fight. Brother June! Hey! <laughs> Sen boy, you been getting rowdy again? Yeah, well, today wasn't much of a fight, to be honest. Well, I'm glad you're in good form. Huh. So, who's this cat? He's my buddy. Huh. Cool. An odd couple, yeah? Yeah. Actually, we're mere acquaintances. Ah. Uh. Say, Richan, is that guy your brother? Uh-uh. No, he's not family. Brother June is from next door. Now he's a really good university student in Tokyo. Let's go. Huh? How about you mind the store for just one little tune? Dad, you always say just one tune, but then you don't come up for two hours. It's not every day Junichi comes to town, right? Richan, I'm asking you too. Next time, I'll treat you to a tasty ice cream soda at our shop. Mm. How about throwing in a cream puff? Natch. <laughs> All right, we got us a deal. Let's get started. Get, get what started? <gasps> a live session. So you've been playing jazz for just two weeks? That's amazing. It was all over the place, but you got the mood. I'm pretty impressed, Slick. You played piano for a while? Yeah, yeah, kind of. How about coming over here from now on to practice with us? Uh, He'll come every day, even without being told. Well, I have to get to work. I'll check you cats on the flip. Thank you, Richon. Oh, that's right, Brother June. 
What's the name of that record you were gonna tell me? Oh, the Elvin Jones one? Yeah, that's it. Tommy something. Flanagan. Maybe it's upstairs. The two of us are alone. Um, say... Reach on. I was just wondering, what do you do on your days off? Oh, you mean with summer vacation coming up? Yeah, right. I was thinking maybe we could do our homework together sometime? That'd be great. I bet I could make real progress working on it with you. How's next Sunday sound? I should be free after 11 sometime. Sure, of course. I know. Let's meet up there behind the church. <sighs> Hold on. I'll draw you a map. That's right. Summer vacation. Up until now, all my summer vacations have been spent alone in my room with far too much time on my hands. What should I do? I have so many things to look forward to that I can't wrap my head around it. Looks like I'm a little early. on a Sunday morning. That's okay. Well, should we... Let's go! <gasps> Wait a second! <laughs> this is how we're going to the library? Or rather, why is he with us? Um, what about the library? hot today. Doesn't it feel much better at the ocean? Centaro agreed this was the way to go, too. Reach on. I meant for this to be a date. Hey! Huh? I rented a boat! Hop in! Dude! How did it come to this? Why did it end up the three of us? <laughs> Richie! Give me a bite of that, would you? Ah, what's with the face? The guy Rowan should get something. Centaro, you can finish this. N no, he can't. Why not? Uh, well, uh, all right then. Here, eat it. <laughs> One bite, huh? Reach on, do you always wear a cross around your neck as well? Nope. I have a rosary. But it's not something you're supposed to wear around your neck. Centaro is special. Our priest says he's made for the church. Rico, you don't have to tell him all of that. For just a second there, the tension was thick enough to cut with a knife. Or was it just in my head? <laughs> Aren't you going to swim? We came all this way, so let's take a dip. Uh, the thing is, I, uh, I didn't bring along a bathing suit. Neither did Centaro. He's just wearing his undies. Uh, I see. Let's swim, Coruscant. Mm-hmm. Sure, okay. Hey! Rico! Dive in! Uh, right! <laughs> what are you being bashful about? You're as flat as a washboard. <laughs> Last time we went swimming, you had nothing but your slip on. Oh, for goodness sake. That's when we were in elementary school. <laughs> Don't say weird things like that in front of Coruscant. <laughs> Enough, Centaro. So do you. Rico, pinch your nose. Uh, what? No, no, put me down, 
isn't he? Huh? Say, Coruscant, why do you keep swimming in circles? This is the only way that I know how to swim with my head out of the water. <laughs> Coruscant, you're a funny guy. Uh, she laughed. Why do I feel so happy when this girl smiles? Oh, I feel like I could do anything for that smile. Hey, you two look like you're having fun. Let me join in. Forget it. Reach on. Let's get away. <laughs> Gorosan, wait for me. Hey, what gives? Why are you swimming away? <laughs> <laughs> Let's trade places. Huh? I'll take over the rowing. It's pretty hard, you know. And on top of Just that, let me you do need it. to... <laughs> Damn it. Uh, you want to switch there, Richie? No. It's not about strength, but how you do it. And I think I'm getting the hang of it. Not that I'm complaining. Yeah. But you've been taking us in circles. Cool. You took us to a completely different beach. <sighs> it's fine. The sun is already setting anyway, so if we tell the boat rental guy what happened, he'll come by and pick it up. Uh. Mm -hmm. Come on, girl. Let's have a little fun. Don't be so stuck up. Mm. I swear, baby, you don't know what you're missing. No! Leave <laughs> me alone! We ain't gonna hurt you. Let go of me! We got a car, so let us take you for a ride. Come on. Hey. Huh? Mm -hmm. The lady ain't uh -huh. willing. So how about you getting your mitts off her? Huh? Are you talking to me? Who the hell? Who the hell do you think you are? Hey, he's up, man. This dude is Kawabuchi from East High. Huh? East End High School. So, so you're Kawabuchi? Uh, this time, I'll let you off the hook. Yeah. <laughs> you saved me. Huh? <gasps> Thank you so much. It happened in an instant. I didn't realize what had just taken place. But when it comes to falling in love, you don't need a reason or time. Fukuhori Yurika, oh. second year, class six, seat number 22. So she's a year ahead of us. She moved here from Tokyo during her first year of middle school. Her hobbies are oil painting and fencing with Naginata. Her birthday is February 10th. That's all, just for your information. Well, uh, what are you talking about? Don't play dumb. This has gotten as hard as a rock. When you think about her, you get a lump in your throat, unable to swallow. 
So you can't get the food down, right? Well... Uh, poor thing. You're completely lovesick. So, this is love? This is what love is? Don't tell me that you've never fallen in love before. Never! You've got to be kidding me. Wait. If he really falls for that girl, then he won't get between Reachon and me. All right. We'll skip Jazz after school today and meet up to make a plan instead. Huh? At my house? We ain't going to Rico's basement? Correct me if I'm wrong, but you'll be able to relax more at home, right? I don't mind, but... If we went to that basement, it's possible Rechon would overhear us talking. Here it is. Uh, this is Rechon's shop. We live in a row house, so Rico's place is connected to ours. Hi, Ma. I'm here. Hey, bro! Hey, oh, uh, hold on, hold on. Where's hey, Ma? Hey, come on and play with us. Richie, uh, what are you doing? Come on in, man. Ma, this is Richie. Oh, hello there. I appreciate you looking out for Centaro. Oh, you're... you're too kind, thank you. Don't be shy. Dig in, Richie. <sighs> I thought you didn't have an appetite today. I can always eat watermelon. Centaro huh? loves his watermelon. He told me he wasn't feeling hungry, which is unusual for him. But I had a hunch he'd be able to eat watermelon, so I iced one up. <laughs> Bro, huh? bro! What is it, Taichi? We found a really weird bug. A bug? Is it a big one? It's over here. Bro, if you plant a watermelon seed, will it grow? Let's plant one and see. Look, there! Oh, there it is. No! <laughs> it flew! Yeesh, don't cry about it. It's okay, man. Buck up. A group date? Yeah, the four of us will go, including Richon and me. If you started with just the two of you, she'd be on guard. Huh? Oh, yeah, I get it. Of course, you'll be the one to invite Miss Yurika. Huh? What's the point if you're not the one who does it? I can't. I, I just don't have it in me, dude. Look here. Huh? huh? What's that sound? Sarah. Sarah? <laughs> My girlfriend. Huh? What's wrong with you, Sarah? You're in a bad mood. Cute, ain't she? Her full name is Sarah Vaughn. A pigeon, huh? <gasps> what is it, Sarah? You're really agitated today. She's probably jealous. Huh? Since you keep talking about another girl and all. Huh? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> huh. What's wrong with me? I'm suddenly enjoying myself. That was so funny. I know. <laughs> it's you. Uh, uh, my... Uh... <sighs> the idiot who runs up to the girl and then runs away. I can't do it, man. Remember the notes. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, he's coming back. I'm... I'm sorry, um... For subtly interrupting you. Are you... Free this weekend. Are you free this weekend? That's what I meant to say. <laughs> I would like to take this opportunity to cult, cult, cultivate, cultivate our friendship. Oh, the idiot! Richie, huh? Richie, huh? She agreed. She said she'll go. Huh? We're going to Rendezvous Rock, right? How about I pack us a nice lunch? Um, that'd be great. Just something light like onigiri. I think that would be great. What do you think? Okay, you can just leave everything to me. By the way, I'm a little fuzzy, so I have a question. Which of the two of you is inviting me out on this date? It helps to know these things. Uh, oh, that would be... Uh, this guy. He insisted on inviting you. Huh? Oh, I see. Well, I'm really looking forward to it. You said okay to a date? Really? You really are a fool. It was going as smooth as can be, and then you blew it. Yeah. I really don't know why I said that. Sorry. 
Wine back time for me, Richie. As if I can. Sorry to keep you waiting. Oh, you haven't kept us long. Hey, what happened to your face? Oh, just another one of Centauro's fights. Let's go, Kalora-san. Uh, wait a minute, Richon. Actually, one more person is joining us today. I'm sorry, <gasps> I'm late. Oh. Uh. Making lunch took longer than I thought it would. Huh? You're the girl those beach jerks were giving such a Th hard that's time right. to. That's right. You remember her, huh? Actually, today, uh... uh. Hey, get a hold of yourself! The nerdy little one with the glasses invited me. Are you all right? Hey! Coruscant invited yes. you? I know you don't know me very well. Is it okay I go hey. along? Oh, of course. The more the merrier. <laughs> really? What's wrong with you today? Good. Oh. So it was Coruscant that asked... must have a weakness for pretty faces. What is it? Oh, nothing. I was just thinking that your hat is really stylish. Oh, this old thing? Even if I wore it, I would still look like a yokel. Oh, no. I don't think that's true at all. If you just let me do... Richan, when did you change your hairstyle? Eureka-san did it for me. What do you think? It looks super cute. I like it a lot. your family owns a record shop. Yes. So tell me, Eureka-san, do you like jazz? Huh? These two practice playing jazz music together just about every day. They play jazz? Uh-huh. Uh Kurasan plays piano and Sintaro is on drums. That's really something. Uh. I know some people who listen to jazz, but this is my first time meeting anyone who actually plays it. My two big brothers like jazz, so I listen every once in a while. Uh -huh. My brothers frown and get a little wrinkle between the eyebrows while they listen. But I prefer music that really hits you with a bang, yeah. you know? That's it! I'd like to hear you play the drums sometime. You... 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 you can't. I still, uh... uh stink at it. Oh, but you know you can't get better at music unless you have an audience. Come on, uh, let me hear you play. This is an unexpected development. Oh! Uh -huh. Oh no! I think I got scratched by a branch. Oh. Huh? Well, what do you know? Looks like he's got moves. Say, I heard a rumor that couples who climb together to the top of that rock will get married. Huh? No girl's gonna get up that thing. Richie, come on, man. You up for it? Why me? Huh? What's wrong with the uh -oh. two of you? I can climb that far. Would anyone like to go with me? Oh, oh. Go on already. Make your move. No, no you can't. Huh? Uh, I just mean that the sign says it's off limits to the public. And it's dangerous. Oh, that's too bad. I really wanted to see the view from up there. shouldn't have wolfed it down. <laughs> Those two seem to be getting on well. Corson, you can have this. Where are you going? I'm just going to pick some flowers. Probably the bathroom. Gosh, this sonagiri is huge. the girl who's most important to me cry. Those shoulders look so sad, but I have no right to try and comfort her.
morning, Corson. Uh, good morning. Richie! Huh? Come with me a sec. This, this handkerchief. Eureka-san gave it to me as an apology for my towel yesterday. It smells kind of nice. Or is it my imagination? <laughs> what the hell was that for? Uh, a Corazon? I couldn't let you pick up this handkerchief. I couldn't bear seeing that. <laughs> hear about the handkerchief, you can have it back. I was in the wrong. It's all my fault. What are you talking about? Spill it, Chief. Shut up! You're satisfied as long as you have this handkerchief, right? Go home and sniff on it all you want! <sighs> That's enough. You looking to start a fight? Stop it! Centauro, let go of him! You let go of him right now! This is stupid. Don't get rough with him. You owe Chorus on an apology. <laughs> that guy? I don't know him nothing. Wait, Centauro! You can't forget this. This handkerchief is important to you, isn't it? Corson? I bet Centauro is drumming away like a madman right about now. You stupid idiot! Like that. You know, it's easier to make up if you do it early on. Come with me to practice. No. You don't seem to realize something. Before you moved here, Centaro always practiced alone. Shutting himself up in the basement, not letting anyone near him. Even I didn't feel welcome in the basement. But ever, ever since you came to us, that feeling's been gone. I'm positive he was happy to find a friend he could play jazz with. Can I guess? Try to see if I know what you were fighting about today? <laughs> you like that girl, right? I mean, you kind of have a crush on her. <gasps> so you got mad at Centaro for showing off that handkerchief. She is really pretty. I wish I'd been born looking like that. Pretty and cultured and refined. What? What are you talking about? Richon, you're plenty... Uh, attractive. Huh? <laughs> Thanks for trying to cheer me up. You're a really sweet guy. I'm not... I wasn't... I wasn't trying to cheer you up. I... Here we are! Huh? Uh, oh, <laughs> luck! <gasps> hey, Richon, open up! Let me out, Richon! Let's go. Outsiders aren't allowed in there. <laughs> Drastic measures. I... I didn't come here to see you. What is it? N nothing He has the same feelings for the girl he likes. Hey, don't just join in. Huh? I wasn't joining in anything. <sighs> He's following along again.
Maybe I'll play something just for Richan. And then... Maybe I'll try letting her know how I feel. Sintaro Kun. I'm coming in now. Oh, don't be so stiff. Uh. <gasps> what the... the hell is he doing? I'm sure Richan is thinking about him. Meanwhile, he's... Um, Richan? Huh? There's a song that I'd like to play for you. Actually, I wanted to practice this song a little more first. But I feel like I have to play it for her right now. This piece I've secretly been practicing my heart out. Play through me, Bill Evans. It's called Someday My Prince Will Come. It's a classic by Bill Evans. So are you the prince, Corazon? <laughs> I'm right, aren't I? You've been practicing for Yurika-san, right? And this is your dress rehearsal? No. Huh? Uh... This is the real performance. Huh? You're the one that I like. It's for you. <gasps> you don't have to give me an answer right away. I just wanted to let you know that there's somebody here who's in love with you. Richan's eyes are on him. She's always thinking of him. Still, that doesn't bother me right now. You taught me that it was possible to fall in love like this. You're the one that I like. It's for you. You don't have to give me an answer right away. I just wanted to let you know that there's somebody here who's in love with you. Richie, you're stopping again, dude. Be quiet. I'm going to come back in here with a cool improv riff. Man, it means nothing if you don't play. Looks like you're having a good time, son. Oh, boy. Mind if I sit in with you guys? Brother June! Oh, you're early. Actually, I already mentioned this to Richon's dad, but I've got some good news. Would you cats be hip to showing your cool vibe in front of an audience? <gasps> the bar I worked at here asked us to do a Christmas performance for him. It's a gaijin bar for U.S. troops stationed here. So if we're gonna do this, let's put some spunk into it. Well, you wanna give it a shot? Yes! Yeah! Good. We just got one month before Christmas, so that doesn't leave us much time. <sighs> so what do you think we should play? That reminds me, Sen. 
Isn't your birthday on Christmas Day? Yeah, I'm almost 16. Huh? Look, we better do a decent performance. It's been a while, so for starters, let's try playing together. Out of sight! This will be our first session as a quartet since summer vacation. One, two, a one, two, three. <laughs> Come on, Richie. Ain't you gonna play? What's wrong, Karu-kun? Once in a while, this guy just freezes up. Karu-kun's got a classical background. I bet my vintage Bessie Smith he's going for gold. Don't think you need to do anything complicated at first. All you really have to do is hit the keys. That's plenty lively for an improvisation. Remember how it felt when you jumped in and went wild when we played during summer vacation? You said it, Brother June. Right on. Go for broke, Bill Evans. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, he looks like him. <laughs> I never thought I'd meet Bill Evans in a place like this. Now I think we can expect you to play great. By the way, what were you doing the other day with Yurikisan? Huh? In the back of the art room after school. You. You saw that? So, are you two already, uh, having that kind of relationship? What do you mean? Don't play dumb. Uh, you can't tell me nothing happened when you're dressed like uh, that. Don't be a dope. She just asked me to model for her painting, stupid. No! Tilt your head more. Look at that twig with real emotion. I didn't get what it was about, but it was over before I knew it. Oh. Is that all? Huh. Why am I so relieved? Oh, that must be it. Come to think of it, she told me to be her model every week from now on. Huh, sounds like there's hope for you yet. What will you do next time? <sighs> if she does something like that to you. Why you? What the hell do you think you're doing? <laughs> Get back here, Hey, who's team? the machine guy anyway? Maybe the <laughs> secret boss. I heard your nephew got the top score in the final exam. That's wonderful, and he's not just a prodigy, he plays the piano. Yes, well, I must confess that I don't like how he hasn't been getting home till late these days. After all, he's the only male heir in the Nishimi family. I have to make sure he maintains his grades so he can go to medical school. Dad, hurry home, would you? Even though I'm surrounded by people, I'm always alone here. That reminds me, Sen, isn't your birthday on Christmas Day? I don't see him buying a new pair for himself. Maybe I'll get them for him, one jazz musician to another. K Korosan? Richan. Oh, oh my gosh. It looks like we both had the same idea. Oh no, this is... Sentaro's a lucky guy. <sighs> oh, I know. We'll each buy one stick and give them to him as a pair. Let's do that, okay? This is a strange development. Maybe it's okay if things stay this way. I wonder what Richan thinks of me. Uh, are you okay? Do you have a cold? No. Winter in Kyushu is pretty cold. I wouldn't be surprised if it started to snow. Oh, it's not that cold. It really snows here in December. Look. <gasps> Korasan, how did you know? This is 
is amazing! Like in a movie, it's beautiful! Oh, it melts right away. This won't stick. part of town. N nothing especially. Hey, bro, he just made Rico... Uh, Rico? What about her? It's a misunderstanding. He's the last person I wanted to see right now. All right. How about we all race home? I'll give you a head start. The winner gets to have the biggest piece of cake. No. Ah, ready? Go. <laughs> Look at him go. You want to join us for cake, too, Richie? Of course not. Oh, yeah. Your family lives high on the hog. Bet you have a fancy cake waiting for you at home. Oh, shut huh? up. Somebody who takes being with a loving family for granted will never understand that there are people who live in a great big house but have no place in that great big house! Am I jealous of him? Because he has the thing I wish for more than anything, but can never have. Go home. Your family's waiting for you, aren't they? When I'm around you, it only makes me feel more miserable! Max Roach. These are some really nice sticks, dude. Thank Reachon for them. I just laid out half the money. Oh, so one stick's from Rico and one's from you, huh? Gotta hand it to you, that's pretty clever. <laughs> Come on! What? Just do it! No, let go of me! Ow! What are you doing? Hurry up! Ow! <laughs> Damn it. <sighs> what? Oh, Reach on. Huh? Why is that kid next to Reach on in all the photos? It's easy to tell when you see me as a little kid, right? That I got mixed blood. <sighs> Richie, I'm one of those that ain't got a place in the house, too. Ever since I was born. Hey, America! Don't look. Centaro! Good grief, mother, stop it! Just look to see if Yasuko's things are in that box. I don't care, she's no daughter of mine. Soldier bearing his child, and in the end, abandoning her shame here before running away. I don't remember giving birth to a daughter like that. Where's Grandma? Oh. So, kid, you didn't see anything either? Huh? 
Centaro, this is apparently a memento your mother left behind when she went away. Ah, Centaro, the rosary isn't a necklace. Take it off. Hey, I sure do like the little necklace you're always wearing to class. Let me borrow it a minute. That's him, Kawafuji, the kid who went nuts yesterday. <laughs> Sentaro, you won't have any friends left if you keep getting into fights like that. It's not like I had any friends to begin with. My dad lost his job around then and stayed home, getting drunk every day. Couldn't even look me in the eye no more. Eventually, though, he found a job in another prefecture. Said he was gonna live and work there for a while. <sighs> I thought it was my fault. He's still working there now. You know, he hasn't come back home in all these years. It's fun at home, never a dull moment. But once in a while, I start thinking if it's really okay for me to be there. <sighs> I've said too much. I'm mortified. I was so convinced this guy had it all. Those things I yelled at him. like we're children playing around on an organ. Sintaro! Yeah? What is it, Karu? Let's practice some more. Maybe even every day, till our gig. <laughs> Dummy, that goes without saying. We gotta show those Americans how it's done. I get it. This is the guy that Richon loves. My love feels so petty in comparison. Since then, we put everything we had into every day's session. Time flew, and before we knew it, the day had come. Our first time on stage. Excuse me. Huh? Foreign soldiers gather at Old Stella to knock a few back. Wouldn't say it's a place appropriate for a lady like you. I've come to listen to jazz. I was invited by a friend. Oh, pardon me, baby. You're a respectable customer. After you, young lady. Stop calling me young lady. It feels like you're mocking me. <gasps> Eureka-san! Ritsuko-chan, long time no see! Huh? Just play like we practiced at first. But you can go crazy with it once you get in the groove. Let's hang loose and have fun. Ladies and gentlemen, let me introduce the Mukai Tsutomu Quartet. <gasps> one, two, one, two, three, four.
can't stand that coon music jazz. Sounds like a jumble of noise. At least play something white. I couldn't hear. What did he say? He says he doesn't like black jazz, so we should play white jazz. Huh? What kind of segregation is that? What are you trying to say, old man, huh? Don't do it, Sen boy. <laughs> Suck it in. You can't go through to a drunk like that. Just ignore him. Huh. I can't play like this. Karukun. Huh? Can you play that one song, but not for me? Oh, I think so. At this rate, the party's gonna end on a sour note. But maybe we can at least lighten up the mood. Um, just the two of us all alone? Don't worry. It'll just be like we're playing for fun. understand why Sentaro gets so excited every time he comes back to town. It's only natural to admire him. Anyway, Brother June really surprised me. You're the hero of the night, Brother June. Oh, Brother <laughs> June, pretending you don't know what I'm talking Damn about. It. so frustrating. <laughs> Thanks to that stupid uh, racist uh, jerk cutting in. I didn't even get to play even half of what we practiced, dude. But it was a good experience. The unexpected is really what makes jazz fun, isn't it? Listen to you, Santa not ah, like an expert. Get it out! Am I bugging you? Um, what do you think? Young Le, I mean. Yurika. Yurika, huh? So, what shall I call you? That's right. Sometimes life is like jazz and goes in an unexpected direction. It's... Uh... Richie! What are you just standing there for? Hey! Rico! How about opening the door? Oh. The door's not locked. Uh. What's with her, dude? Huh? Huh? Ritsuko-chan? Yurika-san? Huh? I love the cakes here. Do you come here often, too? Uh-huh. This shop belongs to Brother June and his family. Oh! Oh, I... I had no idea. What a coincidence. Um... Yurika-san? If you'd like... Why don't you come over to my place to watch them practice? It's over. She hates me. What is that, avant-garde? Come on, Richie. Get your head on straight. How are we gonna have a session, man? Everyone? Huh? Eureka-san is huh? here. Richan, didn't your dad tell you that outsiders aren't allowed down here during a jazz? Session. Eureka san is our friend, so I'm sure dad wouldn't mind. Besides, what could it hurt? Well, Eureka san, enjoy the show. Oh, okay. What's wrong, Karukun? Uh, I'm just going to get a little fresh air. Uh, <gasps> Reach uh. Is 
It's Richie Rich. Uh, Sintaro's sister. Sachiko-chan, right? Are you playing by yourself? Yeah. All my friends are off at cram school. I see. Then how about we play together? Really? Huh? It's not playing? That's strange. Well, that thing's a relic, so sometimes it gets ornery. At a time like this, you have to work a little magic on it. Like this. See? Huh. Oh. Wow, Brother June, amazing! How'd that get it to work? <laughs> Beats me. It's magic, I guess. Hello? Is this the Children's Telephone Counseling Office? Huh? Oh, that's right. There's this boy, Hashiguchi-kun, who's always mean to me. He hides my slippers, pulls my hair. He does all sorts of horrible things to me. What do you think I should do? Hmm, let's see. You know it's possible. Maybe that Hashiguchi-kun actually likes you, Sachiko-chan. Uh -huh. My guess is he wants to be friends with you, but doesn't know how to express his feelings. So he acts out like that without thinking about how it might make you feel. He does not! Recently, I made the girl that I really like cry too. I want to apologize to her, but even if I do, I don't think she'll forgive me. I don't forgive you. Huh? This was my... My first time to... Uh. It's no good. I can't be mad at you. Coruscant? I'm afraid that there's something I have to tell you and I... Coincidentally, I've been going to the shop for a while. I had no idea it was your family's bakery. The coincidences keep on coming. Even the name is similar. <laughs> Actually, there's someone that I like. Right now. He's the only one I can think of. I'm flattered by the way you feel about me, Coruscant. I'm flattered, but... Centaro? Oh, hey there. What's wrong with you? You seem kind of like you're down. Here, eat this and cheer up. Centaro, what should I do? I said something terrible to Koro-san that hurt his feelings. And he might not come back here again and play with you. <laughs> Thank you so much. Sachiko. Mm -hmm. Do you, I mean, do you know who Rico like? I mean. I'm sleepy. Uh, uh. Never mind. School starts again today. <laughs> I, I can't ask. It's impossible to talk about romantic stuff here in this house. Richie, it's been too long. Why didn't you come over for practice during winter vacation, dude? Oh, sorry. Sorry to bother you. The teacher told me to give this to you. Here. Thanks. Dad's finally come back. But everything seems so bleak right now that I can't bring myself to talk about anything. Hey! <laughs> Sen, what are you doing out there? Richie, get out of the way! <laughs> uh, 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 Richie. Get a jacket on. 
We're gonna go practice. Forget it. Oh. Rico is lonely without you around. Come on. All you gotta do is stop by the shop, bro. Uh, I'm not going back there again. Oh. Do you really mean that, Richie? Yeah. Karu, got a minute? <laughs> I thought I heard a loud noise coming from here a minute ago. Oh, really? Never mind. Actually, I wanted to give you this letter we received the other day. A letter? It's from Shizu-san, your old housekeeper, remember? Shizu-san? Oh, that takes me back. Yes. You'll see she wrote about your mother. Oh. No need to tell you that we've had our problems over the years, but it seems that Shizu-san... You see, she happened to run into your mother in Tokyo. She got your mother's address and insisted I pass it on to you. We split up when you were still little, so you might not remember your mom very well. <clears throat> but if you'd like, if you'd like to go see her, you could. Maybe on your next break. I know this is sudden and may leave you at a loss, but whether you go or not is totally up to you. Well, I'll let you get back to your studies. Richie, you can bring her some sweet rice treats as a souvenir. I never said I was going. Huh? You're not going? Right now, I'm just not feeling up to it. Moron! <laughs> you know where she is now, and if you lose this chance, you'll regret it for the rest of your life! Kyle Kuhn! Oh, crap! What are you doing in there? I'm coming in. Wait a second. Karo-kun, you're hiding something, aren't you? No, not especially. <laughs> Trains basically refers to limited express trains from Asakaze that have a dedicated blue sleeper car. I'd love to sleep in one of those. Did you know that the design of the front and back cars are different because they have to switch off being the lead car? I didn't know. Come to think of it, this is my first time traveling alone. Is it like a trip to help me get over my heartache? Hey! <laughs> you're late, Richie! <laughs> you know, it's a good thing I asked Maru to get me a ticket. What? Wait a minute. I felt like taking a trip to Tokyo, too. So I'm tagging along, bro. I only went on this trip so I could be alone and think things over quietly. Man. Travel and frozen tangerines go together like bread and butter. I do have one more tangerine. Well, much obliged, ma'am. They taste better before they thaw, oh. don't they? <laughs> <laughs> Damn that marble. Oh. By the way, how can you afford this? Oh, I had money saved up from my part-time job, and then I sold some old records. You don't have nearly enough. Well... If I could make it to Brother June's house, it'll be okay. <sighs> what a thoughtless fool. Here. This is yours, Richie. Uh, Rico said the food in the dining car is probably expensive, so she made these for us. Ain't you gonna eat it? You know, she's been really worried about you, too. these people is there a festival or a new year's sale tokyo station is always like this why don't you go sightseeing around tokyo nah i want to see what your mom's like dude so i'm coming with you
What the heck? This is some workplace. Wait, wait. maybe I got the address wrong. It's right. Well, let's go in and ask. Uh, wait a second. Huh? I've changed my mind about meeting her. Richie, come on, man. What are you talking about? You've come this far. It's better if I don't see her. Even if I did, I'm short. Uh, all right. Huh? She says it's your mom's day off today. Said she'd meet you here tomorrow afternoon. So we'll come back then. Come on. All right, I say we relax a bit at Brother June's place. Hmm. Pardon me. Do you two have business with the man living there? Uh, yes. Well, there's no point waiting for him. He's been missing since last month. Wait, he's missing? Yeah. I heard he started running around with a bad crowd. And the old lady next door told me he's in hiding. What? Although, it's possible he's shacking up with some girl. He's quite popular with the ladies. Uh, I see him coming in and out of here all the time. Yeah, that doesn't surprise me at all. Right, Richie? Huh? No, not surprised. Wait a minute. Don't tell me that. Did you come from Kyushu? Well, I say we raise our glasses and let's make our guests from far away Kyushu feel welcome. With sochu and water. Come by! Oh. Huh? Water? <laughs> uh. <laughs> That's right. You wouldn't believe how stupid this guy is. This big lug is no end of trouble. <laughs> when I'm with uh. him, his stupidity rubs off on me. <laughs> good for you. You're lucky to have such a good buddy. Uh, buddy? He's not my buddy at all. <laughs> Sounds like it's the most. Pretty rare to have a friend that you can get goofy with. Just someone to hang out with. Friends are for life. Marriages? Not so much. I've never eaten fancy curry like this before. Go on, don't be shy, just eat. Thank you. I like the way you shovel it in. You know, I have always had a thing for men with a hearty appetite. She isn't at all like I imagined her to be. <gasps> what was that? Mother and son perfectly in unison? Sh shut up. <laughs> Sorry, he has no manners. Are you friends from school? Yeah, or more like we play music together. He's a drummer and I play the piano. Piano? Oh, Karu. You used to love it when your dad played the piano. He would play and I'd sing along. And then even if you were crying, you'd always stop and listen. How time has just flown. I must say, it's such a happy memory to have. Oh, really? I don't remember at all. And anyway, Dad never likes to talk about the past. Of course he doesn't. Who would want to talk about a washout of a mother like me? Uh, looks like the rain has stopped, so I'm gonna take a little stroll around Genza. I think he wanted to give us some time alone. But come now, better eat before it gets cold. this curry. It's so much spicier than usual. Uh, Karu! Huh? By the way, how's school going for you? Oh, it's okay. Is there a girl that you like? 
<laughs> oh, did it not work out? Uh, Mom, I'd rather not talk about that right now. Well, tell me, am I right? Wh what's so funny about that, may I ask? Well, well, it's just the idea of the baby boy in my memory who'd say, Mama, and make gurgling noises, having a broken heart. <laughs> 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 a broken heart. <laughs> not bad. That's not right. bad at all. I'm lovelorn. <laughs> <laughs> the more I laughed, the more whatever had been building up inside me disappeared into thin air. My mind emptied out. There he is. I thought you were going to make it in time, dude. Mom, here. For me? It's a jazz record. The song called Lullaby of Birdland. Listen and then try singing along to it. I'll come back to visit you again. So until then, I'd like you to practice that. But I'm not a jazz aficionado. I don't know the language at all. It'll be fine. Just imitate what you hear. Jazz is best sung by a woman with a husky, sexy little voice. Oh. I'll come back for sure, so practice, Mom! Practice! Karu, um, thank you so much for coming to see me. I thought I'd probably never see you again. That's what I told myself. Why did mom leave me behind? Those words that I couldn't ask flew away somewhere with this scenery. Mom's mouth formed the words, I'm sorry. I shook my head, but I'm not sure she saw it. I'm back! Oh, oh that was heavy. Rico! Where were you? Oh. It's good to see you. Welcome back. <laughs> How wonderful. Looks like you and I are in the same class this year, too. I'm so glad. Yeah. If you're happy about it, Richon, I am too. Huh? Now that you mention it, where is he? Hey there! Well, don't you look chipper. Are you that happy about being in class 10 with all the rowdy kids? <sighs> what is it? Nothing. He isn't used to being split into a different class from his friends. This isn't Taro's first time. <laughs> That's okay. I'll get it myself. <laughs> Nishima-kun, I'm so happy we're in the same class again. Are we? Th That's cool. We just did self-introductions. Oh, that's right. You were the little purser who set up his ticket for the sleeper, too, didn't you? <laughs> so sorry about that. He said keep it a secret from you. Because of that, I had a nice trip. Thank you very much. Huh? It's finally over. We should have decided the class rep by drawing lots in the first place. No kidding. Hey, I heard there's already a fight in class <gasps> 10. Jeez, I'm just glad I wasn't put in there. Uh... Hey, are you done already, boxing club? I thought you had a little more spirit than that. Sen! Hi, Richie. Don't give me hi. Why are you fighting on the first day of the new school year? Hey, just getting a little exercise. That was fun. Been too long since I had a fight. 
Hey, Sin, are you listening to me? <laughs> what? What? Wait a minute! Don't go! What do you want? You're going over there with that banged up face? Uh, is it that bad? Reachan. Huh? Sorry, but would you take this guy to the infirmary and patch him up? Um. All right, go, go. Uh. Reachan, he's in your hands. Okay. It still hurts a little. But I should get used to it, eventually. The pain will go away, and I should be able to relax and smile again. I'm going to submit this painting to this year's public exhibition. This is the one Sentaro kun modeled for. Uh, um, uh, uh... Oh no, that's okay. You don't have to force yourself to give me feedback. S sorry I don't know much about art. Oh? That's a strange thing for you to say. Huh? After all, painting and jazz are relatively close cousins, aren't they? A painting is created on a space, while jazz is created during a time called the performance. It's like etching your living self into that place and time. <laughs> or something like that. It's a quote I heard. Junichi-san was talking about that the other day when I went to the basement. <sighs> I'd like to talk to him more about all kinds of things. Our mutual love of art and music. Um, did you hear that I went to Tokyo during spring break? And I dropped by Brother June's boarding house, but he wasn't there. Oh, that's too bad. Apparently, he hadn't been back for a long time, so there were a lot of letters stuffed in his mail slot. Someone said he might be staying over at another person's place. One of those letters could have been very important. I wonder where he went off to. Uh, are you done yet? Just put a little spit on cuts like these and they'll heal up oh, fine. Oh yeah? And what do you do if it gets infected? Come on now, just close your eyes. Uh, what is it? Rico, I'm glad you're in the same class as Richie. From now on, do me a favor and keep an eye out for him instead of me. Um, well, I'd better get going. Richie, glad I caught up to you before you went home. Are those tears? Uh, this glob looks just like a tear. That's the tear of a broken heart. In Greek mythology, the god Apollo fell in love with Daphne, the daughter of a river god. He became obsessed and chased her all around, but she wouldn't stop running. At last, she gave Apollo the ultimate rejection by turning into a bay laurel tree. Oh, what an awful case of heartbreak. Of course he would cry. He's so grief-stricken that he fashions a wreath out of the laurel tree. <laughs> wow. Who's he? Huh? This is Matsuroka Seijukun, a second year student. He's the great hope of East High's art club. Oh, stop it, you're embarrassing me. Kawabuchi Sentaro kun? We're both in class 10, huh? Nice to meet you. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Wee! Richie, do you remember that guy from last year? <laughs> nope. I'm getting the chills, dude. Oh, that's right, Sentaro kun. Uh you wouldn't happen to be free on your next day off. I want to get you a present as thanks for being my model. Hey! Wait up! Hey! Idiot! Apollo my ass! I can never see this guy wearing a laurel wreath. Reach on. Huh? Do you have detention? Yeah. I forgot my math homework, and that's my punishment. That's unusual for someone as level-headed as you, Reach-on. Oh? Who said I was level-headed? I'm careless as can be. I get more absent-minded in the spring, but better snap out of it. <gasps> this song. It's from The Sound of Music. 
I love this song. It's so pretty. Yeah, I figured you would like that movie, Richon. Oh, no, I didn't see it. I wanted to, but before I knew it, it already stopped playing. I bet it was a good movie, huh? How could I miss it? I don't know, I guess I just thought that I'd be able to see it any time. I'm pretty dumb, huh? What is that again? My favorite things, of course. Yeah, that's it. Oh. No, better not. I had my shot. Oh, yeah. There was something I wanted your opinion on, Richie. Hmm? About maybe that date I'm gonna have with... You mean with Yurika-san? Uh, yeah. Well then, I'll give the perfect advice to a romantic beginner like you. Don't go. That's all. Huh? What the hell is that? On a one-on-one -on -one date, I'm absolutely certain you'll freeze up and blow the whole deal. D don't make fun of me, dude. I can handle a date, piece of cake. I'm so sure. You really think you have the confidence to keep TPO in mind in front of that princess and behave accordingly? D D you know what it is? You don't, do you? But for your own sake, you better not go. TP? Jeez, what a pain. I wish everyone would just stop falling in love. <laughs> Well, don't blame me for what happens. Sintaro kun don't hold back. Tell me if you see something you want. Oh, that's all right. I never get expensive stuff like this. It's just not my style. Even this jacket is a hand-me-down. Off the rack of Brother June. Oh, really? And from then on, all we talked about was Brother June. When Brother June was in high school, nobody was cooler. You should have seen it. He was good at fighting and really smart, too. Oh, really? We had a good time talking about him. But now all I got left is a feeling of emptiness in the pit of my stomach. What are you doing, Sen? Did your date go well? Uh, of course it did. That's right. A date is a piece of cake for you. A walk in the park, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, that's... Liar. Uh. It didn't go well at all, did it? Uh. Just like I predicted. Uh. Sen, stay away from her from now on, okay? Huh? What makes you say that all of a sudden? <sighs> you really are dense, aren't you? Any way you look at it, you and a refined girl like that just don't match up. It's what you call being out of your depth. Crap. I went too far. Hi, Kawabuchi-kun. Huh? What is it? I heard you went on a romantic little date with Eureka. And a little bird named Eureka told me she had a great time. Hey, hey is that true? Did she say anything else? Come on, dude, tell me! You want to know? Uh-huh, she said you were a handsome Kawabuchi-kun, and that maybe she'll hold your hand next time. Really? Oh, Richie, you're here, huh? Hey, you want to try playing my favorite things again together? What's this? I thought he'd be mad at me for what I said at lunch, but he seems to be in a great mood. Hey, what's that? Huh? I thought only Jazz was allowed in here. Oh, that kid with the mushroom cut, Matsuoka, forced it on me. I couldn't refuse, so I just carried it here. Huh. W what's that mean? Good for you. Becoming friends with someone who lends you records. Hey, Sen. Huh? 
Would you come upstairs a second? Uh, sure. What? Did a new record come in? I'll just come up here. Okay. Is he going to listen to that record? What am I so anxious about? Kawabuchi-kun, did you listen to the record I gave you yesterday? Nah, I can't get into music that has a bunch of girls squealing all over uh, it. Stop! Isn't that the purpose of making music today? Don't you want to become a really big superstar? Don't really care about that. Stop! Anyway, I'm not interested. Well, I want to be popular. My not-so-secret dream is to become a sensational star. Huh? A star? <laughs> Wait a second. Are those the underpants of somebody who aims to be a star? Oh, these? I've got seven brothers, so if I don't stamp my fabulous signature like this, they'll disappear in a split second. Oh. And we're poor as skunks, so we can't afford to buy new ones often. My brothers call me Sad Little Sally, since singing is really the sole skill I especially excel in. I want to show all those depressive naysayers that I can support my parents and siblings. It's so simple. A band is the smartest first step to success. So I... I want you. Not that way, silly. Just your enormous talent. Now all we need is a drummer with really big sticks. Seiji, are you going to tell me who it is you have in mind? Oh, you'll find out soon enough. Be ready for a surprise. Hey, Rico. Yeah? No school tomorrow, so if you're free, want to go to the beach? Huh? Ma told me to take the munchkins. But looking after them alone is a tough job, so I thought I'd ask you to come along and help out, you know? Um. Well, if you're busy... Uh, hey, Richie! Uh, uh, hold on there. You free tomorrow? Huh? What do you say we have us a clamming contest uh, at the sea? Clamming? Say, Centaro, huh? I like clamming too, but... You... Richie, what's clamming? Is it some kind of competition? Uh... Oh... <laughs> oh, Coruscant. Clamming means digging up clams at the beach. Oh, it's confusing when this guy calls it a contest or whatever. Are you going to reach on? Well, I guess. Great! Oh. Then the threesome set. This is gonna be fun, dudes. I'll need to mentally prepare myself this time. If those two have a romantic moment, I'll casually get out of their way and just pray for reach on's happiness. Or that was the idea. But maybe that's a non-issue. So how long I want to get to the You should have gone to the bathroom before we left. Hello? I got a hamaguri clam! That's a short neck clam. <laughs> <laughs> Look who Sally sees by the seashore! I'm Seiji. It's a pleasure to make your acquaintance. Hi, little boy. I hear there's a secret spot there for razor clams. Razors? You must be Ritsuko-chan. Have I heard stories about you? You're even prettier than she said you were. Uh, oh. Hey, where are uh, the razor clams? Huh? You silly little sea scavenger. They're right over here. Walk this way. <laughs> What's with that guy, and why is he always sweet-talking everyone? Don't criticize the guy when you don't know him, dude. <laughs> hey, bro! You come too! Sure! Wait for it. Patience. Ah! <gasps> Gets me every time! Who's enticed me, right me, now? Me, 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 me. Me. Looks like they're having a good time over there. Do you want to join them? I'll pass. For some reason, that Matsuoka character rubs me the wrong way. <gasps> What's wrong, Taichi? Oh no! I'll be back in a bit. Oh. Trust me, he isn't as scary as he seems at first. Thank goodness. <laughs> oh, hey, Seiji! Don't tell me your drummer is that monster Kawabuchi! Please, Seiji, anybody but him. Uh, I'm against it, too. Oh, trust me, the big lug isn't as scary as he seems at first. 
All I have to do is set him free from what's tying him down, and then things should simply fall into place as I see fit. Hey, Richie! Catching any short necks? Huh? Oh! Better not underestimate me. I'm good at this kind of simple task. Well, you know, I ain't gonna lose neither, dude. All right! Clamming contest, dude! What do I get if I win? How about the record that Reed Sean's dad gave you? Forget about it, because I'm gonna win anyway. So, what about the Beatles record? Kawabuchi-kun, did you listen to it? Yeah, I heard it. Wasn't bad. Stop! It didn't stir you all up inside? I wouldn't go that far, but it's... I'm thinking I'll help you out with that band you're gonna have for the school festival, dude. Seriously? You'll join my rock band? Oh, stop! Richie, don't worry. So I'm just gonna be away till the festival's over with. <laughs> We're just gonna be apart for a while, Nishimikun. Let's send each other letters, okay? In a pig's ass! Huh? I was wrong about you, you stinking traitor! Richie, wait! Listen to me, dude! Don't touch me! I don't want to listen to you. I don't need you anymore. like an angry little kid. But being separated from him scares the hell out of me. I abandoned him without thinking. Since coming here, I'd forgotten that I'm not good at getting along with other people. It's better this way. After all, I've made it this far all on my own. No problem. At all. Good evening. Stomo John. Hey man, look. Hmm? Check out the dude at the end of the counter. Hmm? It can't be. In a pig's ass! Huh? Huh? I was wrong about you, stinking traitor! Richie, wait! Listen to me! Don't touch me! I don't want to listen to you. I don't need you anymore. Oh. My feet feel heavy. It's just like the first time I climbed this slope. Coruscant? Hmm? Would you like to have this onigiri? Why? I'm fine. Just eating half a thing of bread isn't enough to give you energy. You need to keep your strength up. Then I'll have just one. Oh. This is good. What's in it exactly? <laughs> Let's see. Clams boiled in soy sauce. Uh, uh, I shouldn't have said that. I'm such an idiot. In my hey, reach mouth. Out. I can't help but notice that you're on really good terms with uh, Nishimi-san lately. Are you two going steady? Of course not! Look at her, she's blushing! You don't have to hide it from us. Well, we're in your corner. But we're not... Uh, uh, um... Uh, uh, honestly, we're not dating. Mukai-san and I are just friends, nothing more. So please... Please don't get the wrong idea. What did I butt in for? This is a surprise. Nishimi-san, you hardly ever talk, and I pegged you as unapproachable. I thought you were going to be really mad at us. M me too. Uh, hey, tell us something. What's the trick to getting good scores on Yeah, tests? I wanted to ask the same thing. Oh, uh, oh I we don't... put him on the spot. <laughs> huh. What do you know? I don't feel sick at all. Hey, Richie. Uh, uh, don't ignore me! 
Would you just listen to me, you blockhead? Wow! What a pat, Yamaoka kun! And set apart from your house? This is where we're gonna practice every day from now on. Huh? Kawabuchi kun, you look kind of glum. Don't tell me you're having second thoughts. Once I decide I'm gonna do something, I see it through. <laughs> Snap! What a superstar thing to say! We better hurry up and decide what songs we're gonna do. Well, I wanna get the spiders in there. And the ventures, of course. And Wait then... Wait a minute. What about huh? the Beatles? What's with all the different genres? Huh? I just thought the girls will dig it more if we play a sample of Super Songs. Uh, that isn't what you told us before! Darling! Uh, uh, we just got a roll cake. Why don't you share it with your friends? Jeez, Mom, you can't come in here! We're rock and roll, so roll cake is perfect! Mama, don't you stop! Oh, I just love her. So, let's discuss, Renuzke kun Kobuchi kun aren't you coming? No. Nah. I'm gonna stay here and practice a little by myself. Oh, I see. tie on a hot day like this. Oh, yeah. I'm in mourning. For who? John Coltrane. What? No, Pops, not Coltrane. You didn't know. Well, I guess it's only natural that a rock and roller wouldn't get word of it. Please don't bust my chops about that, Pops. That aside, why not take a look in the shop? Real beauty in there. Seen her before. Oh, Eureka-san. Oh. Oh my, I haven't seen you in a while, Sinjuro kun I heard that you're going to be in a rock band for the school festival. I'm looking forward to it. Eureka-san, Chet Baker. If you're interested, you want to hear it? Be quiet. Don't say anything. I can't. Because I... I... Oh. Huh? All right, who's down there? You come out! Come out now! <coughs> oh, sorry. I didn't mean to interrupt you, Sen boy. Brother... June? Don't mind me. You kids go on with what you were doing. <coughs> Damn it! I forgot to tell him about Junichi! Eureka-san! I should give it to her. Sen! <sighs> that packed quite a wallop. Don't look at me like that. You're not good for more than one punch. Wait, Sen. Junichi has had kind of a breakdown. He's not responsible for his actions. Huh? Brother Jun... Uh. What's wrong? Tell me what happened, uh, Sintaro. Oh, Sintaro, wait! Okay, everyone. 
I'd like to decide on the members of the committee for the festival. I'm open to volunteers or nominations. Okay. Then I nominate Nishimi-san and Mukai-san. <gasps> I'm sure those two would take responsibility and do a good job. I think that's a good idea, too. No objections here. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, the brass band. Could you write down the representatives' names and program? Um, can I have an application for them? Uh, here you are. You're good to go. I'm sorry, Korosan. The new term's just begun and you've been saddled with this busy job. Actually, since I was always transferring from school to school, I never had the chance to take on a responsibility like this. It's more fun than I thought. Mm. Korasan, have you talked to Sentaro recently? Not at all. Then you wouldn't know about it. The other day at the shop, Sentaro punched Brother June in the face. <sighs> I didn't see it myself, and I don't know what it was about. But I heard Yurika-san was at the shop that day. Hey, you guys. Could you two bring the completed applications to the student council office? Sure, I'll do it right now. See you later. Kurasan, stay here at the reception desk. Okay. Oh, Rico, good timing. You're on the committee, right? Do me a favor and copy this info onto the application, would you? Forget it. The reception desk is in the materials room. Go over there and fill out the form yourself. I can't accept a scrap of paper. Fill out a form. Did he really hit Brother June? Is he taking it all on himself and suffering in silence? Hey. That band name, in Katakana, it should be spelled with a G, not a Za, for the Olympus. Za is fine. No, it's not. No, that isn't what I want to say. Sen! Excuse me, is there still time to sign up? Uh, yes. Whew, good. Somewhere in my heart, there was still a little hurt and regret. As the festival drew closer, I became busier with my committee duties. And before I knew it, the distance between me and him had grown. I even looked back fondly on that silly conversation, but they seemed so long ago. And at last, the day of the festival arrived. The Olympus is next! I'm gonna go to the front! I can't wait! Keep jamming, right? 
と会うのやらあん You're not going to watch from inside? Things are awkward between me and Suntura Kun right now. It's all my fault, actually. I gave in to loneliness and betrayed him in the worst way. What the? You're on the committee, right? You need to follow me. What happened? Oh. There's suddenly no sound coming from the amps. <sighs> uh, so not rock and roll. The main electrical system isn't down. Sorry, but could you help us look for the cause? We'll split up. Boy, what a bummer, huh? <laughs> hey, second oh. year! You can't do anything without electricity, so quit acting big! I bet you just wanted to show off your fancy schmancy electric guitars. Rub your money in our faces! Why don't you get off the stage? That... hey... Uh. Sorry to burst your bubble, but me and him are poor, and we borrowed the instruments for this show. He may be a flashy guy, but he's got a real goal, and you guys need to respect. So I'll ask you upperclassmen to shut up, and stop interrupting just to amuse yourselves. Uh. 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 Kabuchi-kun, you're actually a nice guy. I'm seeing you in a new light. A new light, eh? Well, just so you know, I'm always uh, nice. Uh, <laughs> why, yes, yes, of course! Of course you are! But I have to say, I really am surprised. I never thought you would join the band. Yeah. I was gonna refuse at first. But then he told me the reason. After he said that he wanted to be a star to support his family, I changed my mind about it. I know how it feels to desperately want to be useful to your family. It's never easy when you feel like you want to help someone, and you're powerless to do it. Uh, um, Kaobuchi-kun, would you consider staying with the band? Nah, this was a one-shot deal for me. Jazz is more up my alley. Besides... I'm keeping my important partner waiting. They can't fix it, huh? Guess I'll go. Stop! No, don't leave! Wait! Wait! Please! Please stay! Don't panic. I'll keep them occupied for a little while. You be ready to go on as soon as the problem's fixed.
they're not really mad, just passionate as they're going back home together. light. It's as if I've been born again. I feel like I've got wings on my feet. The festival was wonderful! Say, Nishimi-san, I'd love to hear you play the piano again. Oh, let me hear it, too! Uh, uh. I'm with the photography club. Let me get a shot. Stand next to each other, you two. This is the birth of the legendary duo of East High. Could you stand closer to each other? Like this? Yes. Hey, when did you two uh, become friends? Uh, and I just have to find out when you guys are going to be on the cover of Tiger Beat. How do you play in oh, such perfect units? Let's unison. get out of here. When I count to five, I'm left. Tell us. You don't five, have to hide anything from four, us. Three, two, one. <laughs> Reach on. The girls were supposed to be chasing after you and me. Right now, those guys are just like the Beatles. Such valuable lessons I've learned. You can just forget about all that next year's festival stuff. I'm looking even further ahead. I'll be a shooting star. They'll be lucky if they just touch my tail. Pops, sorry I haven't been coming recently. Huh, he's not here. Maybe in the basement? Sin, what's wrong? Richie, do me a favor. Would you go downstairs and check to see if Brother June's still down there? What are you talking about? It's not summer vacation, so why would Brother June... Huh. A lot's happened while you boys weren't around. You see, June took off last week. He's not here. Anyway, I haven't seen you boys in a while. Uh, I'm sorry. I've been waiting for you, Richie Rich. <laughs> My piano trio is finally together again. Yeah, Jinichi was disowned by his father right after he came back this summer. Disowned? Well, his parents weren't happy about college in Tokyo. But then he just up and stopped going to school altogether. Then he got all wrapped up in this political activism movement. When the prodigal son wandered back home, it's no wonder his dad was furious. Junichi wasn't allowed to set foot in his family's house, ever. Well, soon after that, I ran into him at the bar. He was three sheets to the wind. So I figured the best thing to do was to let him take refuge here. Let me ask you, Pops. Is it my fault Brother June left here? You can shoot straight with me. No, no, no. 
he happened to find a cheap room to rent on the other side of town. It's not your fault. But Pops, I... Centauro! Do not mope your life away. Playing one good session will drive away those blues of yours. You dig? <laughs> Never mind. Forget I did that. <laughs> I get it! Mr. Bill Evans! <laughs> I get it! What do you say we play a session so I can work off this gloominess? Junichi-san? What are you doing here? Wait! Don't ignore me! <sighs> what made him change this much? That one winter day in the basement. What was that? Did he just do it on a whim? Even if I knock, he may not open the door. Or would he look at me again with those vacant eyes? Sorry, but that doesn't suit you. You win. That angry face of yours is my Achilles heel. You had the same expression when we first met. I remember it well. <sighs> what are you gonna do? Just go home? Or... you give it to him yourself? Oh, I couldn't! I'd be too nervous! So please! <laughs> uh, uh. Huh? For me? It's been a while since the festival, but your popularity hasn't waned at all. Thank you so much. staring at what am i jealous it is nothing to do with me Rijan. <gasps> hey which scarf design do you think is better mm, uh... actually lately there's this guy i kind of like and i'm thinking about making one for him huh who is it i can't say yet but how about you Rijan? isn't there someone that you want to knit one for uh... come on <sighs> let's knit one together um, but I don't have anyone to give it to. Oh, be honest with yourself, Rechan. Just now you were staring at a certain someone. Oh, it's not what you think. Don't get the wrong idea. Yeah, yeah. Nishimi-san is just a friend, right? Uh, <laughs> sorry, I'll be back. Oh. What a beautiful color. I bet Karusan would look good in this. <laughs> huh? Wait a second. What's wrong with me? Why is my heart beating so fast? That day in the basement? Oh, yeah. I almost forgot about that. You want me to tell you why I did it? Was it too stimulating? Did your inner nature start to get the better of you? I'm sorry. I was just feeling kind of mischievous at the time. No! No! Uh, 
was wrong. Didn't you come in here because you wanted me to do this? What were you hoping for? A declaration of love and affection? Sorry to disappoint you, young lady, but this is the kind of guy I am. You stopped fighting back. Are you resigned to it already? Yes. If I act like this, she'll probably run off. <laughs> Is that what you're thinking? Go ahead. I'm not afraid of you. You can do whatever you want to do with me. Damn it. Go home. And don't you ever come back to this place. I'm not the same. I'm a different person. I dropped out of a good college and got disowned from my rich family. Society gave me the boot. And now there's no way for me to get back to the life I had. Get close to me and your life will be ruined too. If you understand what I'm saying, get the hell out of here. What are you doing? I'm sick of you calling me young lady. So I thought I'd get rid of the image you have of me as a young lady. If you're not the same person you once were, then I'll show you that I can become a new person as well. Katsuragi, I'm gonna become a new me. No, don't! Don't go throwing away something precious for someone like me. <laughs> Yo, so you're the Katsuragi kun I've heard so much about. How about saying something to mark the occasion? Huh? Me? Uh, I'm just passing through, but I'd like to share my opinion on what a college should be like. Katsuragi, you inspired me. Uroi. Listening to your speech made me feel ashamed of myself for doing nothing but study for exams and play music. <laughs> hey, Katsuragi. In the next battle, if something were to happen to me, would you take over for me even just for a little while? Harita-san. I... Hey, Muroi. Come over once in a while and play the sax. Katsuragi! Arita-san's been arrested! The bones are shattered, so the doc told me my fingers won't be able to move like they used to. But what about the sax? I can't play anymore. <sighs> don't look so glum, Katsuragi. Now I can dump everything I don't need and just focus on the movement. I'm gonna become a new me. What am I doing? Katsuragi? Hey, wait! Where are you going? I don't want to see any more people get hurt because of me. I don't want to bring you pain like that. I don't know what happened to you. And I don't intend to ask about it. But I can see that you're hurt, deeply wounded inside. Can't I support you? Am I being too pushy? Yeah. You're a pushy woman. Stop taking naps on the roof. Hey, wasn't that Eureka? 
Was she called in by the teacher again? Yeah, Eureka's been acting weird these days. She's totally changed. What happened to that innocence she used to have? Maybe something huh? happened to her. I asked her that, but she wouldn't answer. Well, since she cut her hair like that, could it mean she's got a broken heart? What the hell happened? What did he do to her? So you're Sintaro, huh? You like jazz? Ever since I first met Brother June, he's been like a big brother to me. I wanted to get good at jazz like him, be strong like him, become cool like him. I tried to follow in his footsteps every step of the way, thinking I'd catch up someday. Hey, Sin Boy. Your woman forgot something. <sighs> if Brother June would just talk to me, maybe I'd understand. But if he did something to her, oh. Brother June, I need to talk to you. Uh, son of a bitch! Shit, he's the one person I didn't want to find out about this little arrangement. Oh, come on. What else could you do? He was bound to find out. It's better sooner than later. I knew it. I knew she was beyond my reach from the start. I knew it! Or I thought I did. But... <laughs> hmm. I don't understand myself. Definitely, when I'm with Karusan, I can really feel at ease and have a good time. No. I decided long ago on the person that I like. I'm not gonna change my mind. Hi, Richan. Mm -hmm. Is Sin here? Uh, yeah. I think so. Knitting? Why would she bother hiding that? You're obviously acting strangely today. Tell me about it. I saw him. Huh? Saw who? When I went to Brother June's apartment. She was there with him. Uh, you, you're sure you saw her? Yeah. And of all people, it had to be Brother June. That's what hurts the most. <laughs> anyway, it's over. There's nothing I can do. <sighs> You've still got it good. Even though you were jilted, you still got someone who cares for you. It's like they say, you can't see the forest for the trees. And those trees are so tall, you must not be able to see a damn thing. Hmm? Why don't you try looking more carefully? Isn't it high time you realized it? What? What are you talking about? Figure it out for yourself. Kaurusan? You just got here, and you're leaving already? Uh, yeah. I've got something to do. Are you done knitting for today? <gasps> uh, sorry. I couldn't help glancing at it before. I'm sure he'll like it very much. Huh? <laughs> Richan, you're blushing. Was I right on the money? Well, see you tomorrow. Oh, wait a sec. I... Sure, this is for the best. Don't have a relapse. This doesn't hurt at all.
I won't have it! You and this man from God knows where. Eureka, you've been tricked. What do you know, Father? Shut your mouth! I'll bring home a suitable partner for you before long. So don't meet with this man again, Eureka. Do you understand me? Eureka, your father is just talking to you like that because he's worried about you. You're a girl, so you have to take better care of yourself. Just in case, keep next Saturday open, okay? I made an appointment for you at the gynecologist, okay? Don't be scared. It's gonna be all right. <gasps> Richie, that rat, throws out hints, then goes home. Someone who cares for me. Like my family? Is that what he meant? So you're gonna be the Virgin Mary in the Christmas Nativity play, huh, Sachan? Yeah, but I'm nervous about it. Hashiguchi-kun will be there, so do your best, okay? Don't mention him! I don't care if he... This! You're the one that said you're gonna marry him when you grow up. What? That was a long time ago. Huh? Um, Sentaro, I... When I grow up, I want to get married. Huh? I did love the Isn't world. it high time you realized it? It's next Sunday, yeah. We'll be there! there. <laughs> yeah. it's an Olympus party, will you play your guitar for us? Well, <sighs> if you got a request, I guess so. Oh, awesome. <laughs> Ree-chan, are you coming to the Christmas party, too? Uh, you can go with Nishimi-san, right? Uh, well, I'm not really part of that group, so I think I'll pass. Oh, I'm sorry. There's our annual Christmas celebration party at the church on Sunday. I can't make it. Then Kawabuchi-kun is going to that, too? Yeah. Uh, we should have checked before. Maro-kun, if you don't mind, I think I'd like to go to the party after all. Huh? Really? Of course. You're very welcome. I never thought you'd agree to come, Nishima-kun. Like this. Little by little, it's best to put some distance between us. I'm sure of it. <laughs> hey! You're late, Richie baby! Uh, hello? All right. Next, we'll play the spiders! Oh, what about the Beatles? So let's go with Bang Bang Bang! Yeah! <laughs> Nishimi-san, how about some cider, huh? Oh, thank you. Come on, Nishimi-san, let's sing together. <sighs> Sorry, I don't really know the popular songs. I wonder what he's doing right now. Maybe he's talking to Rijan at the church? I go to a party, and all I do is think about those two. I feel like a fool. 
Kairu-san? Huh? Richon, why are you here? I thought you were going to church. Yeah, uh, the church's Christmas party is over. He isn't here with you? Well, no. Why? Does he have to be? Huh? Uh, um, well, he... he went home with all of his brothers and sisters. Oh, I see. <laughs> it's cold, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. Hey, come on! <laughs> I got Whoa. you, baby. Come to think of it, it's almost his birthday, isn't it? I hope you finish in time. Why would... Huh? Why do you say things like that? <sighs> You're wrong! This is for... Uh... <sighs> Never mind! I can't believe you! You're an idiot! You're so insensitive! What did I do this time? I don't know. It's hard to understand, women. Why did I lose my temper like that? I'm the one who rejected Kaurasan in the first place. Even if I finished knitting this, there's no way I'd be able to give it to him. This is hopeless. It's a dumb idea anyway. I'm so relieved. You're safe for now, Eureka. But let me tell you something, all right? I... I just think you really I know. need to pay attention in the You're future. You're going to tell me not to see him, right? You don't have to keep repeating yourself. Chet! Oh. No! Chet! Chet! Centaro, what are you doing here? What am I? I've been waiting for you. Why? I, I mean, why are you acting so strangely? <gasps> Rico. I'm sorry. Uh? I have to confess that I never realized how you felt till now. I may have said some dumb things and hurt your feelings, and I'm sorry for that. I didn't mean... To hurt you. I'm sorry, but, uh, how can I put it? But about your feelings, I, uh, I just... Sintaro, <sighs> <laughs> huh? why are you suddenly on your best behavior? Stop it already. This isn't a Yakuza movie. This is just you and me. Did I get it wrong? Yeah. You got it wrong. Oh, oh, a misunderstanding. S sorry for talking so weird. <laughs> That's all right. You and I are like family. You made me nervous for a second there. In, in that case, good. We're family. So I couldn't stand the thought that I could possibly cause you pain. It would break my heart. Thank you for saying that. I'm glad I heard this now and not a while back. W what's that supposed to mean? Uh, uh. I'm never going to tell a blockhead like you. Uh. Uh. Oh. There's something I have to tell you. I'm going back to Tokyo soon to live my life. probably won't see you again. An upperclassman from my college is starting up his own publishing company. He wants me to help him. I plan on leaving soon after New Year's. It's taken a long time to get to this point, but I owe it to you for making
making me think I should give going back one more try. I'm grateful. Idiot. I don't want to hear those words. Just don't leave me. But I can't bring myself to say that. Not when he's finally trying to move forward. <gasps> Ritsuko-chan! Uh, Eureka-san! What, what are you doing? Looking for something? I carelessly threw something away that was important to me. Hey, is that girl homeless? Say, Ritsuko-chan. Uh, never mind me. Please, go on ahead. A beautiful girl like you shouldn't be seen doing something like this, Eureka-san. Ritsuko-chan. Huh? I'll help you. Huh? <gasps> oh! Please, please don't do that! It's something important, isn't it? Eureka-san. So, what am I looking for exactly? Uh... Oh, uh, here it is! This is it, right? Yes! <laughs> but it looks like I'll have to start over with a ball of clean yarn. Is this going to be a present for someone? Um... Well, it's... Why did you throw away something that was so obviously important to you? I was confused. I suddenly felt stupid for knitting a gift that I'd never be able to give. Not to him, anyway. Why wouldn't you be able to? Because a lot of things have happened between us. And there was one time that I hurt him terribly. You turned him down, didn't you? I didn't tell him that I like him now, so I decided to let it go. But then I thought to myself that that just wouldn't do. And there was another time when I said nothing and just gave up without even trying anymore. Do you regret it? Gosh, no. I realized I had given up on that dream a very long time ago. Besides, I came to understand that this person has been there to support me all this time whenever I fell down in my life. I had no confidence in myself, but he did his best to encourage me. And this time, I'll tell him how I feel. Yeah, I finally decided to stop keeping my mouth shut and be honest. Uh. Mm. Oh, I'm sorry for talking about this. No, I'm glad you did. I think you've opened my eyes as well. So, um, by the way, who is it? Who's your magic prince, Ritsuko-chan? Oh, oh, that's not something that... <laughs> Shall I try and guess? Whoa, what are you saying? Please <laughs> stop. <laughs> You're so cute. <laughs> Yes, I'm set to leave this weekend. Working in Tokyo? Yeah. A lot happened to college and I ended up dropping out. But you'll come back once in a while, won't you? Like you've been doing? No way. I'm never coming back to this town. Karukun, our sessions were fun. I'll miss seeing you and Senboy. But I don't want you guys to stop playing jazz. Uh, Brother June, did you tell him you were going back to Tokyo? Hey, Sen! What's the hubbub? You seem kind of tense. It's about Brother June. Yeah, he's about to go back to Tokyo, right? I heard that from Pops. Uh? Well, ain't got nothing to do with me. Hey, want a jam? You're gonna let that be the last you see of him? There's nothing to say. You looked up to that man as a big brother since you were just a little kid. You may never get the chance to meet him again. Ever! There'd be no point. Once he's gone, it'll be too late! Enough about Brother June already. Let's get started here. <sighs> If you don't feel like practicing, I'm going home. What's all the fuss about? I 
guess they're college students from Tokyo. They're demonstrating against letting the nuclear aircraft carrier into port. Oh, well, that's terrible. In their eyes, I'm a traitor. They may never forgive me, but... All I can do is search in my own way from now on. Using a different method than them. Oh, you're here, Richie. Here, eat. I made it myself, so it might be a little salty. But if you're not gonna eat it, I will. Is this any time to be eating? Huh? Did you forget what I said last time? What are you talking about? Don't play dumb! Are you going to be stubborn till it's too late? Brother June is leaving this town today or tomorrow, never to return to you! Huh? It's today. <laughs> I'm taking the night train, Karukon. Huh? Sen boy, this was rather old-fashioned of you, I gotta say. I thought it was some kind of <gasps> joke. It's no joke. I wanted to try having a serious showdown with you, Brother June. Uh, uh, wait, you're not really... Oh! Looks like I made it in time. Come on, I want in. Sorry for causing you so much trouble, Pops. Huh, <laughs> tell me about it. When you reach Tokyo, there's one thing you need to do. Find a barber. <laughs> sure, sure. Well, I'm off. Brother June. I'll remember today's session for the rest of my life. Yeah. Me too, Sen boy. What are you doing here? I told you not to see me off. I have four questions I want you to answer. If you try to dodge me, I'll get on this train with you. So answer me truthfully. Question number one. Why did you tell me not to see you off? Because I really hate goodbye scenes. They're maudlin. Question number two. Didn't you think to take me with you when you were leaving? The work I'm going to be doing is kind of a gamble. Even if I took you with me, there's no guarantee. Besides, you're still in high school, too young. Question number three. Why didn't you do anything more than kiss me? <clears throat> Did you not touch me because you intended to leave me right from the very start? You know, the subway is always no. interesting. I knew. I knew how much you cared about me. And so, my last question. 
Won't you take me with you? I want you to take good care of your own life. You know, I figured you would say something like that. Now it feels like I've been set free too. I'm going back to my own world. Thank you so much, Junichi-san. Goodbye. Yurika, where are you? Come out, Yurika! How dare you embarrass us by walking out in the middle of an arranged marriage meeting like that? Calm down, dear. Please, just We're going down. back there together, Yurika! Yurika, come back here! Like the heater. Huh? Huh? Can I really keep these? It's probably some mistake. Good morning, Mukai san. Uh, uh, morning! Good morning, Karu san. Kinda cold today, isn't it? Uh, good morning. <laughs> morning, Ri chan. <laughs> morning. That's right. Can't let myself get my hopes up. I've already been rejected once. Usual, ma'am? Ah, there you are. The usual. Thank you. You're looking beautiful as always, ma'am. See ya! Oh, oh my gosh, it's you. Why the cross look scowling, Stevie Poo? Let me gander a guess. You're in shock over the news that Yurika Senpai eloped with her love. Uh, it's all over the school, you silly. Page six. Oh! Did you tell him about it? Oh, Kawabuchi kun? Yeah, I told him this morning. Uh, I don't think he's in the classroom. I didn't expect to hear anything like this. How must he feel about it? Ah, <sighs> oh, that's the one that won the Prefectural Governor's Award. We better take it down now. <laughs> you take that side. Um, what are you doing? There's no way the school will display a painting by a student who's involved in a scandal. We were told to remove it right away. And what's going to happen to it after you take it down? You got me, dude. W wait! This painting is important, please! Huh? So what is she to you exactly, anyway? So you had eyes for her, huh, bud? What? <laughs> Let it go, Richie. <sighs> Sorry. You can take it away. Sen? Hey, Sen, why? You don't care what happens to that painting? Hey! <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> Let go of me! <laughs> what are you laughing at? Your stupidity must be contagious, dude. What? What do you mean? Seriously, how stupid are you gonna be for somebody else's sake? It's ridiculous. Hold on, what about the painting? Oh, I already said my goodbye to it back there. I feel much better now. Mm. 
Sen? Hmm? Have you gotten a present from someone recently? Like something that was knitted? Yeah, I did. I knitted Centauro's sweater and used the leftover yarn to make the mittens. <laughs> That's cruel, but it figures. This. It's called lily yarn or something. I got it from Sachiko yesterday. Uh, anything else? Nope, this is it. But for the life of me, I don't know what I'm supposed to do with this string. Huh? <laughs> Snowballed you! What the heck are you? <laughs> now you're gonna get it! <laughs> Richie, wait! Oh. That was close. Um, by the way, these are really warm. Thank you. Richie! Oh, yeah. What are you doing? <laughs> Come to think of it, we'll be changing classes again soon. I guess third years are split up according to their grades, so you probably won't be in the same class as Karusan. Oh, going for your entrance exams, right, Richie? Uh, yeah. I intend to go to college as well. I've been thinking a long time about going for a degree in elementary education. Oh, so you're gonna be a teacher, huh? What about it? Long time ago, you said you wanted to have a bakery or a cake shop, something like that. What? When was this? Come on, don't you remember? You were a glutton. That's why you wanted to shop. I never said that. So tell me, what university do you want to go to? Uh, oh, I'm still thinking. I haven't decided yet. As for me, never mind about college. I may not even make it to third year. I see. Wait, <gasps> what did you just say? All right, it all comes down to the next makeup exam. Start with these basic problems. I'll make you some flashcards in the meanwhile. You handle that, got it? <laughs> hey! I'm just not cut out for studying. What are you going to do if you fail this? Oh, uh, I'll just quit school and get a job. You must be joking. It ain't a joke, dude. When I think about my family, I can't afford to repeat a year. No way! I huh? won't let that happen. I'm not gonna let you flunk this test. Questions. Uh, I can't take it anymore. If you're going to rest, it'll have to wait till you're done with these problems. I can't. My head's gonna explode, uh, dude. Bro. Oh, look out! <laughs> Pile driver, dude! Look out! Hey, Sen? Huh? You look really happy when you're surrounded by children. It's so heartwarming to see that. Where'd that come from, dude? I bet you're going to have a big family of your own, with lots of love and laughter around, and happy kids. It'll be a warm... Uh. Eh? Chico, wet herself! Uh, wet herself? <laughs> Chico. Bath's over there. My mom will dry your pants, so relax in the meantime, dude. This is an unusual setup for a bath. Sachan? Huh? You're out of soap, right? Here. Huh? Ah! Ah! I'm so sorry. I I don't understand. Isn't this Sin's family's bath? Well, you see, we have to share the bath with Centaro's family. You know, I wish I had... I really wish that I had given the mittens to you earlier. Spring's close. 
so you kind of don't really have a lot of use for them anymore. Oh, that doesn't matter. Since you knitted the mittens, Richan, I'd like to wear them all year round. Cold! Uh, condensation? Drops often fall in there. Centaro lets out a yelp once in a while himself. Say, Richan, why did you give me those mittens? Huh? Wh why? Why to me? Why to me and not to him? I mean, if you felt this way, if you've liked him all this time, why didn't you ever... Richie, how about having dinner here? Your pants aren't dry yet, anyway. I'm, I'm going home now. Thank you for the hospitality. Ah, wait, your hair's soaking wet. You'll catch cold, bro. It's enough! Uh, sorry. Well, see you tomorrow. I didn't mean to say that to reach on. But I couldn't get it out of my mind that she probably still has feelings for him. Deep feelings. <laughs> Sen, how'd the makeup exam go? Oh, you passed. Yeah. Good for you. It's thanks to Richie. I gotta thank him proper. And come to think of it, I haven't seen Richie Rich lately. What's up? The day before yesterday, he passed out in class. He had a really high fever. So he's resting up at home. Ritzko didn't say a thing about it. Someday huh? my prince will come? Uh, no, no, that was just... It was... Uh... Rico, would you come with me, please? Huh? Look at it. Huge, ain't it? That's Richie's house. Yeah? All right, go on. Thank Richie for me, for helping me study. Uh, uh, but, Centaro, wait! Come on by yourself, God. Let's go together. <laughs> Kaoru san, one of your classmates has come to wish you well. Uh, excuse me. Hi, Richan. Um, is your fever down? Yeah. Sorry to make you worry so much. I see. That's good then. Oh, that's right. These are for you. Eat them if you're up to it. Oh, thank you. Did you go out of the way to buy them? Uh, um, not really. I didn't actually buy these myself. They were... Centaro bought them. Richan, he came here with you, didn't he? Huh? I saw you two out the window. He should have come in with you. Karu-san. <coughs> Never mind. I understand. <laughs> what are you talking about? It makes sense. You two have been together since you were little. There's no way I could be a match for him. Unlike me, he is strong and built and so handsome. He even takes my breath away once in a while. Reach on. Although I wish things were different, you're better off with him. Stop it already! I know what you're saying, so don't say another word. Bye. I shouldn't leave you alone. Kaurusan, don't you like me anymore? Or is it... You just don't have any confidence, so you're trying to keep your distance? 
Don't you remember? You told me to have confidence in myself. These words have saved me a number of times. But if it looks like you don't have confidence, I have a feeling I'll lose mine too. Huh? What the heck am I doing? What I've wished for all this time. Leaving already? You were very gracious. Thank you so much. Oh boy, I bet something happened between those two. Huh? Reach on! Kamar-san! Don't come here. I'll go over to you. I feel about you one more time. I love you, Richard. I love you, Richard. I love you, Richard. I love you, Richard. I love Please be quiet. Your relatives can hear your every word. Let them hear. I'm not. I'm not muscular, and maybe I'm not as manly as I should be, or maybe I could be. But when it comes to my feelings for you, Richan, I'm second to no one. But I hope you don't catch my cold. I don't mind at all. Oh! Oh, Korosan! Hey! You're burning up, and you're heavy! Excuse me! Somebody! That was Corazon, really something, was me! It is summer already, and I haven't made any more progress with Richan. Even though I was that bold when I had a fever, what's wrong with me when my temperature is normal? I want to touch. Touch what? Ah! What did you hear? I just got here. Did you hear anything? Like what? Nothing! Both of you, take a look at this! The Olympus has thrown down the gauntlet. What is this? In the most anticipated event, the Olympus is going to win at this year's festival. It seems there are still some old-fashioned jazz musicians around, but this is the era of rock and roll! They were handing this out all over the school. What are you gonna do? I mean, you can't take this sitting down, right? You two are gonna perform in the festival. Well? I've been thinking. Me too. We start with Monin to fire up the people that saw us last year and fake them out thinking we're gonna do the same routine. Their minds will be blown. But then we move into some other songs that we want to play. <laughs> I was thinking the same thing, dude. All right, let's choose our next song. Starting today, we'd better practice every day. Of course, bro. How about this one? Mm. Well, let me see. I'm home. Welcome home, bro. Hey. Look. I got surprising news. Dad says he's coming home. This way the whole family can live together. Sachan. What are you doing here? Are you all right? Is anything wrong? I can't say that I'm actually scared. What do you mean by scared? See, our dad, who was working far away, is coming home tomorrow morning. It's been so long. Richie, I'm one of those that ain't got a place in the house, too. Richie? I'm home. Hey, you're back awfully late, Sachko. Huh? <laughs> What's Richie doing here with you? I see. Unlike with Coda and the other little ones, you're old enough to remember how scary and violent Dad was when he was drunk. But don't worry, Sachko. Dad's better now. He quit drinking. 
You see, little one, that was the reason for his trip. Really? Yeah. You got nothing to worry about, Sachiko. Now, how about coming inside and we can prepare together? Yeah. Sen. Oh, thanks for looking after her. It was nice of you, dude. It's not her I'm worried about. I'm more concerned about you, you Sen. <laughs> Dope! What are you looking so serious for? Say what? I am serious. I mean what I'm saying. Richie, don't worry so much. I'm fine. Bro, look! Come in! Sen! Practice. You are coming tomorrow, aren't you? Yeah. After all, playing with you is the most fun I have. Hey, bro, what are you writing? Hmm. Nah, that's no good. It's not coming out right. Ah, uh, well. Let's go to sleep. Richie, I'm sorry for lying to you. I was looking forward to the festival, too. I wanted to perform. Be good to Rico. Take care. Richie, I'm sorry for lying to you. Be good to Rico. Take care. And just where do you think you're going this early in the morning? I thought you were acting odd last night. Looks like the sneaking suspicion I had was spot on. Hey, wait! Wait, I said! Let go of me! Planning on leaving everyone and everything behind? Sorry, I can't be here. Not anymore. <laughs> You're a coward. When did you become so frightened? Where's the guy that told me nothing good comes out of being afraid? Well, where is he? Where? <laughs> what the hell are you guys doing this early in the morning? Richie Rich? You okay? What? <sighs> so you two were fighting about the festival? I understand that you're really into it, but... I just couldn't sleep at all last night, so I felt I... Huh? The truth is, I was scared too. Huh. Is something the matter? Let me stay like this, just for a minute. Please reach on. Let's go. Did you bring in today's paper? Uh, yeah, I left it by the phone. Oh, I see it. I'm home. It's Dad. <gasps> Welcome <gasps> home, Dad. Welcome home. Hey, Dad, your hair's turned gray. Has it now? I suppose it has. Did you bring us presents? <laughs> yes, I bought you stuff. Yay! Let's have them then! Hey, at least let him set foot in the house first. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone, I'm sorry for being away all this time. <gasps> you look cute! <laughs> look, bro! That's great, Taichi. And this <laughs> is for you, Sentaro. <gasps> I don't know if you'll Check like it, it or not.
Wow, it's a <gasps> fountain pen. Oh, you're lucky, bro. <laughs> wow. Yeah, that's cool. Something expensive like this <laughs> is wasted on me. A child doesn't turn down a present from his parent. Oh, looks like everyone got a present. Sachko, mm -hmm. pass these out. Okay. Come on, come on, come on. Let me see it. <laughs> The child, his parent. <sighs> Are you coming to practice today? Yeah, I'm gonna practice my ass off for the festival. You mean it? I mean it, dude. What the hell? That's a weird way to greet each other. Me? At the festival? Yes, exactly. I was hoping that you would play bass for us. You guys are asking me out of the blue. Adults have a lot of things on their plate, you know. There'd be so much to prepare. You can't do it? <sighs> Prepared. Ain't no way we can lose now. Hey, hey! How's it going for you guys? Oh, oh. Right now, we're in the middle of getting our costumes fitted. There's no way we're going to lose against you guys this year. So flamboyant. We, on the other hand, are plain. Way too plain. Huh? We don't have any razzmatazz. At this rate, we might not be able to beat them. That stuff doesn't matter. All we gotta do is put our music face to face against theirs. I know, I know that! But this is our last school festival. I just don't want to have any regrets. Not this time. We're going for broke. Easy to say. But appealing to people who have no interest in jazz is a tall order. There are still 10 days left. We'll work it out. Rico, mm. if you're gonna refuse, now's the time. Because if you decide to do it, we're not gonna go easy on you. You don't want to sing Tell Us to Shove Off right now. But personally, I think it would be a good thing for you to join us. I agree with Sen. Would you help us out? For you guys, I'll give it a try. <gasps> Drops of roses and whiskers of kittens. Raindrops of roses and whiskers on kittens. Kittens. No, no, no! You've got no swing! Raindrops of roses and whiskers on kittens. Bright copper kittens and warm woolen mittens. Brown paper packages tied up with strings. These are a few of my favorite things. Green colored ponies and crisp apple strudels. Doorbirds and slavers and schnitzel with noodles.
a few of my favorite things. My own favorite things are the footsteps of a certain person heading towards the house, the sound of the piano and drums riffing in the basement, the laughter of two boys. <laughs> Silly, I know. Huh? What the heck is that, Centaro? <laughs> Go on, Richie, your turn. Huh? Tell us your favorite things, dude. I don't have any. Even before Richon said hers, I had something in mind. My favorite thing is this time, right now. Tomorrow's the day. This is it. All that's left is playing our best at the festival. Richie, how about playing Monin one more time? Hmm. Nah, let's save it for tomorrow. If you and I started jamming now, we'd be going at it all night. <laughs> I see. Yeah, you're right. Well, see you tomorrow then. Don't be late. Yeah. Oh, he forgot to take this. Well, you don't need a score for jazz, right? And I can just give it to him tomorrow. Oh, where are you going? I'm gonna run to deliver something he left behind. Karusan left a while ago. You might not be able to catch up. I know, I know. Late. Where could he be? Hey, hey! It's almost time for our battle! Huh? Where's your partner? Don't tell me he's late. No, uh... Seiji! Come on, you Greek goddess! Stop! Okay, we'll see you later. <sighs> Reach on. Centaro... Uh. Uh, he got into an accident on a motorbike last night and was taken to the hospital. So, tell me, how is he, Richon? I don't know, and I don't know what to do. And what if he's... if Centauros... Richon, calm down. I'll go to the hospital to see how he is. Stay here until I get back. dashed down this slope countless times, but it's never felt this long. Um, excuse me. I'm looking for... I'll help you when it's your turn, so please stand in line. <laughs> Wait! there was an accident. They just finished the operation. But it's a very serious head trauma. Still hasn't regained consciousness. Might never wake up again, the doctor said. You should never talk like that! But she said... <laughs> That's right! Even when Sen is all bloody from a fight, whether he wins or loses, he just laughs it off! <laughs> Karu, Sachko is the one who's in there. Uh, I don't know why she was doing it. She never liked the bike, but last night she was riding on the back of Bro's bike, and they got hit by a car. Then, how is he? He's hurt, but the doctors say he's gonna make it. He was sitting over here just before. I see. Thanks. That's right. The place he's most likely to go is... 
gotta be. <laughs> I believe I've seen this angel before somewhere. If you're gonna take somebody to heaven, could you make it me and not Sachko, Angel? Why do I end up hurting the ones I most want to protect in this life? Why was I even born in the first place? Richie. What's wrong with me? Hey, what's the matter with you? Are you... Are you crying, dude? Huh. This way, we don't have to see each other cry. It's easier that way. <laughs> what do you mean, we? I ain't it's cry okay to cry, Sen. You've been keeping it bottled up all this time. He was just stepping out. But he disappeared, and the festival was over before it even began. And then... What are you doing here, Richie? Kaoru-san. Um, here. If you're able to eat these... Do you know where my big bro Sen went? Uh, he would normally never give me a ride on his bike. But I had a twisted ankle, and kept complaining about it to him, so he did. The accident was my fault, it wasn't his at all. I have to apologize to him, and I have to say I'm sorry for everything. Sachan, right now, if you focus on getting better, I know that Centaro will come back soon. You want to show him that you're healthy again, right? Yeah. I know I said those encouraging words to her, but the truth is... What'll I tell her? If Centaro never comes back... It'll crush her. Richan, We're talking about him. I bet when we least expect it, he'll suddenly turn up. Don't you have that feeling? Yeah, you're right. He will come back, won't he? Sure. Do me a favor, please. Don't go anywhere, okay? Um, excuse me. Hmm? Oh, I remember you. Richikun, right? Do I know where he might be? No, I'm afraid I don't. Um, father? He left 
He left this behind. He told me once the reason he always wore the rosary as a necklace was because he was afraid that if he lost it, he would be abandoned by the world. Left alone. Maybe Sen had come back. Uh, I think... Well, Pops... He's not coming back. Huh? I'll never be able to practice with him again. Well, what are you talking about, Richie? Never. Never again. <laughs> Nishimi? Nishimi? Uh, You're back at the end of the class. I was worried with your grades dropping there for a while, but it looks like you've straightened out your act. Maybe it's because entrance exams are looming. Or maybe it's thanks to the disappearance of that impediment to your studies. Whatever the case. Come on, dude, let's go. the roof, but then they went right for it. <laughs> I heard a third year thug was keeping the key to themselves. You think have that little machines that play music? Dreaming. Hi, pretty boy. Oh my god, I'm playing volleyball with the girls. How about joining in? No, I think I'll pass. Pretty boy. I know you've been lonely without Kawabuchi-kun. But you've got to get over it! You're right. Thanks. Looking for uh, Nishimi-kun? Uh, no, that's okay. <laughs> it's cold. I love milkshakes when it starts getting cold outside. It's so tingling. Hey, Ritsuko-san? Are you awake? Huh? Yeah. Could it be you're worried about Kawabuchi-kun after he disappeared? Yeah, yeah there's that, too. I know, it's Nishimi-san, isn't it? Like, you haven't been able to talk at all or go home together recently. Huh? Ri-chan, you can't just wait for it. You need to make things happen for yourself. Ah, uh, uh, hey, look! Huh? Isn't that Nishimi-san? Huh? <gasps> <gasps> Ri-chan? <laughs> Were you eating sweets? You've got whipped cream on your mouth. Huh? Uh, listen, are you coming to the basement after school? No, sorry. With entrance exams coming up, I've decided not to go for a while. I see. 
Yeah, that makes sense. Tell Pops that I'm sorry for not being able to come. Well, see Hey, ya. wait! Kaguru-san? Um, why not study at my place? Uh... The shop's closed today? Where's your dad? He's off buying up stock, so it's just me today. Give me a second. I'll clean up here. Isn't it sweet? Uh, that one's my favorite photo. I always have it out here. <laughs> Both of you look so happy in the picture. Look at the expression on Sentaro's face. Stop talking <gasps> about him. Shall we get started? English and math, right? So first of all, the word order is reversed. This so comes before, and the subject and verb change places. Uh, what is it? Um, I'm sorry about before. You see, I wasn't thinking about how you felt when I showed you that photo. Since Sentaro left, you're the one it's hit the hardest, isn't it? I'm fine. He may not be around, but I've still got you, Richon. I'm sorry about that. Richan, I haven't been able to say this before, but I'm going to a college in Tokyo. I'll go home for the day. difference anyway. Everyone's going their own way in life. We'll all forget being here in no time and not speak of it. Nishima-kun? Your performance at the school festival? I'll never forget it. It meant so much! Excuse me. Huh? Maruo-san? Could I... I have... Could I have the second button on your jacket? Uh, sure. If you'd be satisfied with mine... <laughs> I'm thrilled! I wasn't sure if I'd be able to ask you. <laughs> I was crying my eyes out. I was. I'm so happy. <laughs> <laughs> Goodbye and good riddance to this damn slope. Don't go trudging up that thing tomorrow. <laughs>
I see. So you're going off to a college in Tokyo too, huh, Richie? Well, you'll probably get a little lonely around here. Now nah, we can't get gloomy about it. It's great news, isn't it? Oh, that's right. Ritzko was accepted at the college here. Hey, Ritzko! Come down! Richie Rich got into college! Hey! Uh -oh. Reach on! You can stay there, but just listen. I'm sorry about that day. You may not want to hear anything from me, but just let me say this. The reason I started coming here is because I wanted to see your smile. Reach on, please just listen to me. Your smile always encouraged me, even when things were rough. I never knew that feeling before meeting you. Thank you, Reach on. Meeting you was a blessing to me. You meant so much. I just wanted you to know that. Call us as soon as you get there, all right? I will. Karakun, you can write me a letter and I won't mind. Mm -hmm. Thank you for everything. Hey! Huh, I made it in time. Here, a little going away gift. Oh, uh, thanks, Pops. Um, is Reach on? No. But there is a little something for lunch in there that Ritzko made for you. Well, take care, Richie. I will. You too, Pops. See you again. It's okay. When you're sick, you're apt to lose heart, but like they say, sickness and health start with the mind. Doctor, you have a good head on your shoulders for a young one. Oh, no. I'm still a rookie. Dr. Nishimi, we've got an emergency. Okay. I'll be right there. There's a free bed in the nap room. Why don't you go get a little rest, huh? No. If I lie down now, it's all over. I won't be able to come back. <laughs> yeah, being a resident on the night shift is even harder than I heard it'd be. It takes a lot of stamina, you know? Tell me about it. Our guest is a popular star who both sings and acts. Matsuoka Seiji-san joins us in the studio today. Stop! Huh? Hello, I'm Matsuo Kaseji. I want to start right off with Huh? What was wrong? Uh, th that's a classmate from high school. Uh, uh that, my little sister goes nuts over that guy. Hey, get me an autograph, will ya? I see. So Matsuoka's dream came true. Dream. <gasps> I 
don't believe it. <sighs> Karukun? Karukun, is that you? Yurika son? How wonderful! You've become a neurosurgeon! Um. Oh, I'm six months along. Junichi san wants a girl, but. I wonder. <laughs> I think he'd spoil her rotten, don't you? How are you? Have you been good? Do you still play the piano? No, not anymore. I'd heard that Sintaro had taken off to places unknown, but you've never seen him since then, have you? Oh, that's right. This is no time to be catching up. There's something I've been carrying around to show everyone. Let me show you. A friend from back home sent me this photo, but don't you think the person on the far left looks like someone we know? <gasps> I know! <laughs> A priest! Can I... could I borrow this photo? What the hell am I doing? I've been trying to forget him all this time, but my heart is beating fast. There's no way I can stop this rhythm in my heart. This thumping and thumping and thumping. If, if you want the church, it's at the top of the slope. Young priest, huh? I don't know. The priest here has been around for years and years. Yeah, I think he helps raise the orphans from around the prefecture. He raises children? Yes, you mean the priest in training. Uh, Though I hear he does nothing but cause trouble for the poor priest. Th thank you. Could it be? Could it be him? see this every day today.
Enough! What do you two think you're doing? I told you that you can only play on special occasions, but again, you defy me with that devil music! Uh-oh. Run, Richie! Hey, wait, come back here, Sam! 